Good morning, chat. How's it going, guys? Uh, so many things are going on. Hold on one second. First off, that music is far too loud. So let's turn that down. No, down, not off. There we go. Down. Whoa! My chair is too high. Oh dear. That's the wrong lever. There we go. Yeah, this is Big Giant Circles. What we were listening to before was uh, Zircon. Augment. Hello, everybody. How is everybody doing? It is time for video games with Video James. I am Video James, and we're gonna play some video games. More importantly, we're gonna play Minecraft because that's what we always play. Seriously, I think I might have a problem. Valkyrie Lemons, I am doing quite well. How are you doing this morning? Can't wear hats, Rebellious Uno's here. Diamond Tiki in the house. Yeah, we are starting the Direwolf 20 mod pack today. I am very excited to get going on a new and exciting mod pack. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Eating chips, watching James. Life is good. That sounds sweet. I wish I could be eating chips. Uh, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do this. That's a little bit better. No, I don't feel so quite freaking blurg. Time for clicking first. Yeah, I guess, uh, Valkyrie Lemons, I just got a job. Sweet. I guess I should probably go over to, what were we playing again? Cookie Clicker? I almost don't even care anymore. <laughs> happening over in the world of Cookie Clicker. Oh wow, lots of stuff. All right, so, um, hey guys, this is the first, um, this is the first time I am streaming with the new overlay. Uh, I'm sure a lot of you are now uh, well aware of it. Um, we, uh, we tweaked it a little bit for the new year, uh, for a new year of streaming with a couple new shows, which have already premiered, and I, uh, I understand that they went very well. I hope you guys enjoyed them. Um, so, for anybody who doesn't really know, uh, really quickly, uh, it's all pretty simple. The going online commercial and going offline has a little bit of animation to them now. Um, you'll see that when I go on my first commercial break, uh, and you might have seen that, um, if uh, you were here at the very start. Uh, if we go over to PC, and we're gonna do that, there we go. So you'll notice um, a couple changes here. Um, thinner border, um, also, hmm, hold on, I wanna try to uh, move, there we go. That's a little bit more centered. Um, yeah, so you'll notice that the the blur, the equalizer in the opening gra there was that is a uh, video games with video James uh, special that doesn't exist for anybody else. Um, that's just my thing. It's a little weird. It's also it's just a. Uh, I'm gonna actually go ahead and make myself a little bit bigger here. Boop, there we go. I'm gonna change this. We're gonna change this to, um, uh, we're gonna change this to nothing for now. And we'll get into that later. So, um, so you'll notice that down here, um, the uh, social carousel, as Paul calls it, down in the lower corner there, watch stream replays, YouTube slash Loading Ready Live, and that will actually rotate uh, throughout the stream. Um, if you're new to the channel right now, and if you hit that follow button, um, you'll notice um, we have a new notification for followers to give um, followers a little bit of a nod for um, giving the channel the follow, which um, we've been meaning to do for a while now, and we finally have that set up. Uh, we have a new uh, subscriber image that uh, I believe drops into frame from up above um, when somebody subscribes, so... There we go, right there. Lamb mower! You, what? You always, what? I thought we'd made that so you couldn't abuse it. Hmm. 
Because clearly, Landmower, you were following the channel before. Oh, you can refollow once? Okay, don't do that, please. Uh, the stats in the back end get really weird if you do that. I appreciate you showing it off, but no more. Um, if you want to subscribe, you are more than welcome to do that. All right. You can refollow once per stream? Oh, God. Okay, stop that. Stop. No more. Um, yeah, so that's the new overlay. It's uh, pretty swank. Uh, we're all pretty happy with it. Um, the, um, the actual... I like it because there's no more... The overlay no longer cuts anything off. Um, uh, you can... Right here, you should be able to see this. So this area here is now the perfect size. So uh, let's buy some more grandmas, I guess. Wow, I was not able to buy that many grandmas. That's weird. Okay, well, there we go, I, I guess. We got some more grandmas. Stats. Uh, that's not it. What do we want? Why can't I see grandma stats? Weird. Oh, 41. Right, we have 41 grandmas. Should not have said anything. Yeah, that, I'll remember that for the for next time. Okay, so let's um, let's just turn this down a little bit more. Actually, if uh, rebellious Uno, you want to uh, unmute yourself and join us. Fair enough. I'll uh, just do that. Hooray! Hey guys. All right. So there is rebellious Uno to join me for the inaugural day of... Oh, God. Ooh, that's super sketchy. Um, all right, I want to make sure that the music is good. You can still hear you. So, yeah, if I just talk over the music, check that people can hear me then. Can everybody hear Uno quite well? All right, I think we're gonna go with that for now. Fair enough, we can always change it in a bit. Music is kind of, okay, so how is it now? Levels are good, all right, fine now. Perfect, okay, so um, Uno, what are we doing today? Uh, so we are uh, not going back into Monster after there was, uh... There was an accident. A, it wasn't really an accident, it was quite deliberate. <laughs> uh, but, uh, there's not a lot of the old base left. So, it's time to kick off a new world. Alright. Uh, that's actually... hold on. One second. Now the music is, like, almost too loud for me. Hey. What the... Oh, God. Stupid. Firefox is not letting me adjust the volume. Why isn't it... Grrr. Oh, is that? No, oh, it's this. There we go. There we go. Alright, I feel pretty good about this. Alright, let's open up the server here, guys. See what happens. You were correct, it is Flash, not Firefox. Alright, well, we figured it out. Okay, you're in. I'll uh, hop in after. All right, loading up the world. I appear to be, well, it's raining. And oh dear God, this is quite the spawn. Uh, just one second. I'm gonna turn down the weather sounds here. 
I can't see it yet, and I dread to think what it's going to be. Uh, I mean, it's not bad. I'm on the side of a cliff. <laughs> yeah, as we all know. Stone Beach. I see you on the mini-map. I don't see you... Where are you? Oh, yeah, I'm above you. Yeah. Oh, yeah, there you are. What up? Yo. All right. So, this is our spawn. Ha, it works. What works? Uh, do you remember the mod I uh, emailed you about the other day? Yeah, I need to get that installed on here. Because that's a client-side mod, not server, right? Okay. <laughs> we live here now? We certainly do not. Uh, I guess let's start going this way. I all looked off. Not like spawn being so high. Uh, wow, that's a big mountain. Let's go over this way. So, the... Um, one of the first things I want to do today, guys, um, is actually get the subwall back up and running. Because the fact is, is that um, if we just go and build it when we have the materials, it's going to be probably a little while before we can do that. So, at some point today, we're going to cheat basically the the subwall back in. I'm just getting over this mountain's pain. <laughs> All right. I would rather. Hey, this guy has a sweet hat on. Ah, uh, yeah. One of the uh, nice mods in this is the hat mod. So when you kill when oh, you kill a mob, God. you get his hat. And I fell. Oh dear. Hey, a witch's hat. That's what that is, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, we're on the edge of the swamp there. Sweet. Is that... Should we mark that? That seems like it would be good. Um, we probably want to mark stuff near wherever we sort of set up base. So that we know the stuff's near. Uh, right. You may actually be interested to play about with the minimap. If you press J on your keyboard... J. Holy crap. You get a huge uh, map interface. Yeah, you do. Uh, which wow. You can turn things on and off. You can use it to control waypoints. Uh, you can change the theme of it. If you want to add a waypoint, Ooh. you just press B. Wow. Actually, hold on one second. I need to add. I want to add this to the lower third. We are playing the Dire Wolf 20. 1.7.10. Mod pack. There we go. All right. There we go. Oh, wow. And then there's this whole map. Holy shit. So as I B lets you set waypoints, uh, Control B lets you manage your waypoints. Wow, you can see like chickens and cows and sheep on this crazy ass map. Uh, yep, damn handy. All right, close. Okay. Uh, right B. Let's call it Witch Hut. Save. All right. And it's cool. almost night time. That's what we wanted. Hey, you stupid sheep. I was trying to get your hat, and then you made me fall off a cliff. Haha! <laughs> I got ah. a cool hat. So you press H to control your hats. Huzzah! Tentacool. Do I have a cool hat? 
Um, if you press uh, H and then you have to select it and then press done. There you go. Uh, what is it, F5? <laughs> uh, yep, you're wearing the tentacle hat. Okay. Um, crap. Now it's nighttime and there are zombies and stuff. We, we, we can take them, right? Uh, I don't know. Maybe the witch will let us stay in her house overnight. Oh, uh, she sounds friendly. Ah, oh, punching zombies. Hooray! Hooray! Maybe, maybe we should punch some trees. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Oh, okay. We're good. We're good. Uh, the morph mod, I think, is enabled, yes. Yeah, it is. You uh, look in front of you about now. Oh god, you're a zombie. Oh god. Oh god, that was a creeper. I feel like this could be going better for us. <laughs> well, we jumped in on this uh, sort of right in the middle of uh, it came to be night time. But there are better starts. Hooray, I have a sword. And a pickaxe. All I can see at the minute is that you're staring at a crafting bench. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Are we going to track Uno's deaths? Ooh! Probably, yeah. That would only make sense. Alright. Try not to die to... Keep the stats going. Uh, that's chicken. Right. Uh Oh, the Windows toolbar e wait, yeah, hold on. Why is that? Hold on. Uh video. Can I go full screen? That's probably better. It used to be. Oh god, what are you doing? No, ah, you're a zombie. Oh. Uh, it used to be that I had to do that because of the way that we were formatting, but I just realized now that we're set up like this, I can actually go full screen on Minecraft. What a concept. Better sword. Better pickaxe. It's more the pickaxe I'm interested in. Alright. Okay, we need it to be daytime, so we can find where we're gonna live. Um, so there's a way of doing that. We can bolt. What can we do? Actually, can we... We can make a bed. Yeah, I was just gonna say. Got enough sheep. How much wool do you have? Uh, I've got one. I've got one. Alright, one more sheep. Uh, we need one more. Where are you, sheepies? Oh god, that's a lot of spiders. Do do do. This is the uh, Direwolf 20 mod pack. You can see it right down there in the lower third. Uh, ah, there's an 
the sheep uh, south. I think. I don't see any sheep on the map. Back there, yep. I don't see. Ow! Legs. There we go. Oh, there's one down Come there. Alright. Come back to the crafting bench after, I guess. I have two wool now. Sweet. I have one. We can make a bed. If I could get up, actually get up. Uh, that zombie was wearing a top hat. I know. Now I have a top hat. Done. All right. So this this cliff face didn't seem nearly as uh, steep on the way down. <laughs> Right, there we go, I'm up. There you go. Hooray. Oh, watch out for this creeper. No! <laughs> Don't kill the bed! What the? Oh, that was a telecreeper. Oh, so when they explode, they teleport you? Yep. Sick. Uh-oh. Do we both have to be sleeping? No, we don't. Nope. We have Morpheus on. Perfect. Morpheus uh, requires only 50% of the people on the server to sleep. Sick. Okay, let's, uh, let's continue on and try to find somewhere to live. Ah, now you've got a skeleton morph. If you press the square brackets, you can uh, change which morph you're in. Oh, yeah. And you can use the scroll wheel to scroll up and down, and then left click to uh, change morph. However, because you've just turned into a skeleton in the daytime, you will likely catch fire. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Everything is so... We need, like, fl where's some flat land? <laughs> yeah, so the terrain generation is obviously some 1.7 stuff, which is why we have these uh, weird dark oak woods. But we've also got uh, biomes of plenty, which right. is giving us some nice new biomes. Some of these mushrooms might be handy. Mystical red flower. Mystical light blue flower. Uh, so those flowers are Britannia, uh, which is sort of like a, a magic mod that plays about with, fly, uh, with flowers. Sweet. Uh, it's actually really quite cool. Uh, has some really nice effects to it. like a volcano up here. Ooh. That looks tempting. Ah, nice volcano. Volcano and... Oops. Sweet. Is that... What is the... What rock is this? Uh, basalt, I think. Oh yeah, it is basalt. Sweet. Cool. Uh, I do see some relatively looking... Maybe over here? Uh, there's a snowy area to the west. Yeah. I just saw, I saw this space.
Yeah, it's on the river. Hmm. Alright, what's over here? <laughs> build into the side of a volca volcano. Uh, I don't want to build into a volcano. That just seems like you're asking for pro trouble. It looks cool, though. What the crap? Skystone? Oh, right, okay, so the new Applied Energistics uh, requires some world gen to get going. This is basically a meteorite. Cool. Um, inside that, there will be a chest with some things we want, so... Oh, really? Yeah. Can't get through there with the stone pickaxe. I'm just going to make a note of it. Do I see your waypoints? Need... Uh, no, I don't think you can. I don't know if I can share them with you. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Waypoints. No, I don't think there's a way I can share them. Oh well, that's fine. Alright. Well, let's, uh, let's go this way. Oh, you ate some flesh, zombie flesh. I did. Um, cool. Uh, did you have any miniature red hearts by any chance on you? Uh, no. Because if you find those, you can eat those, and it'll basically fill your life total up. Yeah, sweet. I did not have any of those. Ooh, that's a cool forest. Uh, bamboo forest. Say what? Yeah, these are pretty cool. Puzzle bamboo. Whoa, that all fell down. Can you do oh, anything? Nice. Anything with bamboo? Ooh, you can make bamboo you thatching. Can use it as sticks as well. Oh really? Yeah. So if you need to, if you need sticks, you can use it in place of sticks. At least for quartz stuff. Oh yeah, there we go for other stuff as well. Cool. Uh, do do do. What's up? We have a second to talk about closing magic here. You're, you're like obviously on stream. Yes. Why don't I just take cover some female people? Okay. Do, okay. do what you gotta do, man. Okay, well, you need to haggle for it. Sorry? I can't haggle with you, Russ. Like, I'm supposed to haggle, but I can't really haggle with you. What's the most money you can give us? 250 bucks. Done. Okay. I right, just take whatever you want, man. It's fine. Good luck. Thank you. See you guys. Ooh, slime. Sorry, guys, we have, uh,. Our local uh, YJ representative here, looking at a lot of our cards. Uh, hey, this looks like an okay spot. Yeah, that looks like it's opening out nicely. Is that planes that were in there? Yep. There's also a terrifying straw man over there. Oh, what the hell is that? What does that guy do? He's just a Terrifying straw man. Weird. He doesn't come to life, will he? Whoa, what? I hope not. What the crap hat, hat is that? Piggy, give me that hat. Foam finger. Alright. Yeah, I feel like this looks... This feels pretty good. Yeah, yeah, this seems... Uh, this Seems pretty good. Whole lot of fucking grass, though. Gotta clear all that out. There we go. 
There's just an Enderman over there with like a hard hat or something. Lots of horses. Looks like there's Yeah, I just I just kill the horse so that I can make the obvious joke. <laughs> Uh, looks like there's, like, desert over there a little ways, so... Alright. And we've got a slime island up there as well. Yep. Right up there. Oh, we've got a giant hole in the ground right here. Oh, that's, uh... Yeah, that's pretty deep. That's pretty good, though, because I... We can make that safe to climb down. Yeah. And that's a pretty good way of getting down to uh, get some mining done. Alright. Let's uh let's build some stuff. Uh what's this si what's how do you make that sickle. sickle again? Sickle. Wooden sickle. Uh you can make one out of flint. Oh. Whoops. As well. I think I have cheat mode on. Uh Recipe mode, that's what I want. Alright, where's that big hole in the ground? Bicycle. Mark, mark I did, this on the map as well. I did not earn you. Or you. What? Or you. Alright. Sun's starting to uh, go down as well. Yeah, I'll go to sleep in just a second. Let's just quickly get a piece of wood here. There we go. That's a hat befitting my stature. Alright. Did you just grab a, a wooden sickle, or did you grab a uh, stone one? Just a wooden one for now. So many seeds. Yeah, there's a few different types of seeds. Um, right, I'm gonna go to bed. There's a couple of mobs that add various seeds. Witchery adds uh, nature stuff. Alright. Let's keep going here. Well, if I can do the next one, then I'll that'll set my spawn here as well. Yep. Because I'm starving to death, that's why. <laughs> oh, I'm going to also be almost starving to death. Ah! Uh, I think if we're in normal mode, we shouldn't immediately die of starvation. Uh, I'll just eat this raw pork. So much seeds. All right, yeah, normal starvation doesn't kill you, so I think we're fine. Let's do this. Sorry, I've got a furnace here as well. Oh, sick.
Chicken. Alright, we've got some pork going in there as well. Oh, I have half a heart. Dear Dr. Well, James, if you have the something pneumatic pen, craft seeds on the ground for two to three seconds, they replant. Yeah, yeah so pneumatic craft has this um, mechanic where Go away. The seeds will plant themselves. Oh. That's, and they propagate. That's annoying. No. Um, it can get quite annoying. Ah! Depending on the... Depending on the propagation mechanic that they've got. Alright. Um, more. Nope. Burn. I could do getting a bit more wood. I need some wood and some stone. I've got ten, ten cobblestone on me. Alright. Uh, maybe I'll go. Oh, there's some bubble stone right here. Let's go mine up this stuff. Oh, I've got all this bamboo. Why am I why the hell am I making sticks? Yeah, that's kind of sweet that you can just... Come on, coal? No, it doesn't look like it. Alright. Dig up the wicker man? Oh, but he's so chill. He's not hurting anybody. He is a lot of hay, though. Uh, a lot of wheat. Oh, I guess that's true. Alright, let's go knock him down. <laughs> I can think of nothing bad that's happened with Wicker Man. Yeah, that's true. Tiny oak trees. I get this feeling that if I actually did pick up Minecraft, I wouldn't be able to play it without James' playlist in the background. Well, that's very easy. You can buy all of Jimmy's music. Oh god, there's a spawner under here. There's a spawner underneath the... Um, the Wicker Man. Wicker Man. I've never actually taken one down. Should I? Uh, zombie spawner. Yeah. Do we want to? What do we want to do with that? Uh, do we want to keep it, or do we just want to break it? I don't know. Uh, currently the the goal is to uh, just sort of set up our initial base, and then we're going to be building a the sub wall, and then we'll there's start. No, like, there's no chest or anything under it. Yeah, I mean, we can just break it. I don't really care. Yeah, break it. We'll right. find some more. No reason to... What the? Huh. It... Oh, you have the broken spawner. Yeah. Um, I think it's with Ender.io. Yeah, um, you can use them to uh, make spawners. Oh. And you can sort of fix them. You need broken spawners to make Ender.io powered spawners. Huh, that's cool. All right. We need a lot more stone if we want to make a really quick house. Um, there's seven cobble on the floor there. There's lots of cobble over here. Let's gonna mine this up. Some coal would be nice as well. <laughs> uh, Torch up our area a little bit. 
I guess this chest here looks like a plant's chest. Yeah, for now. I think we probably should make another one. I've made two more. Sweet. So put like edible things in one and then... Yeah. Alright. What's a misc? Oh, also guys, the other thing with my stream now uh, is it's now a scheduled five-hour stream. So, um, every Thursday I will now be streaming from uh, from 9 o'clock till 2 o'clock, at least in my time zone. That's what time it is. So that's exciting. And then Magic starts actually an hour earlier than it used to. Uh, and just, that's an extra hour. So... Uh, Thursdays is a lot more scheduled streaming. I think we have like, what, five, nine, twelve hours of s scheduled streaming on, on Thursdays now? That's a lot of stream. That's a lot of streaming. One thing I definitely want to do this mod pack is make cool, a cooler looking base, but for now, um, I guess let's just make the 9x9. <laughs> well, we've got chisel, so we can start with chisel blocks That's uh, true. very soon. That's true. Because you only need a little bit of iron for chisel. Uh, there's some cooked food in the chest as well now. Sweet. Does a four-hour Mitko stream mean two drafts? I've always thought that you guys finished at the two-hour and thirty mark. Yeah, what we'll probably do is, um, um, we'll probably start with like, we can we it means we can do like maybe an eight-four and see what happens, or we could play. We've talked about actually getting into like constructed of some sort. I don't really know what that means. It could be standard. It could just be like silly standard decks that we just sort of play for fun not like try to make competitive decks we'll figure it out though so today just probably expect like two drafts all right so all right well let's make the initial nine by nine here Three times. I was like, no, I'm sure that's ten. <laughs> and this will be our door. Well, I know uh, there is an Academy Draft video. Uh, I think there was just a bit of a delay, but it will be up soon. Uh, we did definitely record one, so. Oh dear god. Hey, there we go. Spawn more inside. Sweet. Um, you have a cobblestone. Uh, I don't have a lot left, but I have some. We will need more to complete this house. Go and grab some more cobble. <laughs> do you and Uno get separate rooms or do you have to sleep in the same bed? Uh, we're cheap. We sleep in the same bed. Only one of us sleeps in it once. Yeah, we, we alternate. It's kind of a weird broken system where I can't... It means I didn't get to sleep last night, so my Minecraft man is exhausted. Well, I'm no longer well rested. Uh... I still need to sleep at least once to uh, set my spawn if the bed ever moves. Yeah. At least. Dear Dr. James, you need to make a cobblestone generator with a transfer node from extra utilities. You will never want to. S you will never want for stone again, ever. It's true. It's definitely something we could do. Uh, that is, in fact, what we did uh, 
towards the end of the last world. Yeah, that's right. Uh, I've got some coal here as well. Oh, sweet. I see there's some charcoal going, so that's good. Uh, yeah, that's one of the first things I uh, try and get going is charcoal. Need more wood. Look at all the tiny little trees over here. Ooh, got enough bamboo for a thatched roof. Oh, that sounds pretty sweet. We could do that. Uh, I don't know if we do. Figure it out. Oh, God. <laughs> I was not paying attention to where I was going. <laughs> uh, oh, damn that hole. I almost fell all the way down the hole. Oh, uh, I mean, lava, there's water down there, yeah. Woo! And lava. Which is quite useful. Okay. Well then, that was, uh, Jesus. That was close. Yeah, time to build a fence. Yeah. Oh god, my... Okay. <laughs> Luckily, my pickaxe died after the exact last piece of stone I needed to break for to get back up. Okay. Oh, there you are. Well, that was terrifying. <laughs> We did, and I did find some coal, so I guess that's something. Uh, what, what was I even doing? Uh, you were getting wood, I think? Oh yeah, because I was going to make a door. I remember now. Um... Alright. Whoops, I was gonna move this stuff inside. Oh, right, okay. Uh, just break the sign then. Leave the bed there until um, until we get to night, though. Yep. All right. It's a chest here and heat along this wall, I guess. Uh, this can be our food chest. This can be our. Miscellaneous stuff. We've built the house in the plains biome. Uh, we haven't waypointed the house yet. No, we probably should do that. <laughs> uh, you might not have. Alright then. I should probably do that. Base. Save. Do you have another one of the signs? Uh, I do have one of the signs, yes. Here you go. So that's food. This is miscellaneous. Plants. Plants. Perfect. Get rid of all this seeds and stuff. And I guess, actually, the hay bale... Should I make the hay bale into wheat? Yeah, that'll be useful. And then we can turn it into bread. That's a crap ton of wheat I just made. You can just craft it into um, uh, flour. Sweet. 
All right, let's go. I'm gonna go finish this. Oh yeah, we were gonna, we were talking about a thatched roof, right? Yep. Uh, bamboo thatching. It's just some bamboo. Here you go. Sweet. All right, I gotta go up and. All right. Do, do, do. Dear Dr. James, are you gonna try more nuclear-based mining? Uh, maybe not for the foreseeable future. All right. Um, that was quite laggy. It was. Should go one higher. I guess we can go one higher. Yep. Uh, uh, there. Oh yeah, right. I lost my. There's a bookshelf here if you want to put your your books on it. I think I ditched my books in the shell or one of the chests. So. By all oh, yeah, means. there they are. I'll put them on the bookshelf then. Alright, and the thatched. It does look pretty nice. Yeah, it does. Definitely gonna need more bamboo. Do we have some? Hmm. Torches. Also. Do you have any more cobble? Um, it's all went into the misc chest. Hmm. Is not there. You can go and grab some. What's um? Oh, that's the hole. <laughs> yeah. They put a sign up or something. Actually, make another chest here. And put building blocks and material in there. Dirt, wood. The chest on the right. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, that opens into a ravine. James, what happened to your building schools? I remember that awesome castle gate you made. Yeah, it's true. It's definitely something I want to do. Bet I want to do a better job of in this uh, in this map, which is make things look kind of cool. So, which we were already well on our way of doing. Because look at that sweet thatched roof. <laughs> so, can we? You can see that bamboo forest from where you are. Uh, yes. If you wanted to go and grab some more bamboo. I will get some more, more bamboo, yes. Dead leaf pile. Interesting. Alright. I like bamboo, because if you just break the bottom, they all fall. Yeah, that's kind of, kind of handy. Oh, I've got tra the translocator mods on here. That's useful. <laughs> I have a thatched roof. That thatch roof roofs are cool now. They are cool. Oh god, it's becoming nighttime. Ah, uh, if you want to head back and then yeah, move we should to move bed, her bed. Yeah, I'll just try not to die. Yeah, Katana Blaster. The song is so good. 
All right, let's take our bed and put it inside. Going to sleep. Hey. Hooray. All right. I've got some iron as well here. Oh, sweet. Need a little bit more. Should be enough. Ugh. Eight bamboo off. <laughs> Guess we could make a nice skylight. I guess if we do this. This. And this. You can slab the bamboo. Ooh, that's kind of cool. Not in there, you can't. Interesting. If I slab the bamboo, I get s six oak wood slabs. It must be um, all dictionary with it. Drying rack up there. Nice. All right, let's go get some sand, and then we can make some sweet glass. So one thing I did pick up while I was down there is I found some um, essence strawberry bushes. Oh, sweet. So those are the type of bush that you will get XP out of. Yes. All right. Is it possible to build a sand generator? That seemed even more useful than a cobble generator. Uh, you pulverize cobble. Yeah, you absolutely can. So basically what you, do, you need to do is make a cobblestone generator and then basically ship that all into a pulverizer. Um, what's... Well what bucket options do we have? What can you make a rope ladder? Ooh. I want to make a rope ladder. Cotton. Glaze bucket. Flax. Is there a flax? Double skylight seems strong. Yeah, I thought so. Uh, all right, got some trees planted. Sweet. This is very bush. Uh, there's some more cobblestone here as well. 
sweet. Um, I wanted to make a sweet rope ladder to go down here. Uh, you need some string for that. Yeah. Bye, sheepy. <laughs> it um, does not need to be that sheep. I guess for string, spiders are the best option. Yeah, there is some string. What the crap? <laughs> Sorry, horsey, I gotta kill you because I want your hat. <laughs> oh, I don't now you can make the obvious joke. <laughs> yeah. uh, we need six string, we have two. We have two? Yep. Mm -hmm. Is there any way to make string other than, I guess, cotton is one? Yeah, cotton or flax. Of which I think we have neither. Or macerate wool. <laughs> Things that we're in no position to do yet. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Alright. Why, why did the horse die with pig squeals? I was wondering that too. Uh, probably don't ask questions. Don't even worry about it. Yeah, don't even worry about it, exactly. Uh, alright. Uh, maybe it's worth, uh, trying to... get a bit more mine, mine done, get some resources. James, maybe, maybe consider making the Mine Factory fishing rod and getting some fish for food. Oh, fishing's fishing's better in one seven, isn't it? Mine, which one? Mine factory. So probably that one. The the one that's uh, covered in deck cord. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. The one the one that explodes. <laughs> what? Holy! It's a dynamite fishing rod. Jesus! Look at what you need to make you. We don't have any of this. We need a lot of rubber. And redstone. Alright, well, I'm, I'm all about making a, uh, a fishing rod that explodes. How much wool do, uh, not wool, how much, um, wheat and things do we have? How much wheat? We have a yeah. lot of wheat. We have almost, we have over two and a half stacks of wheat. If we could, uh, I see at least one cow over here. Oh, start actually breeding cows? Yeah. There's a cow over here as well. There's a cow by you and a cow by me. That sounds like the start of a cow farm. Alright, uh, we should probably... Do you want me to make a fenced-in area, then? Yeah, if we get some sort of fence... I don't think uh, we... I'll... Definitely... Drag a cow over? Definitely gonna need more wood. And... Phone is ringing. Just one sec, guys.
Dear God. Whoa, hey, look at all the cows. <laughs> yeah, does somebody want cows? We need somewhere to put them. <laughs> uh, do we have anything to make fences with? Uh, Not really. Put them in a hole in the ground for a minute. We got one. In, uh... Well, we got two. Come on. Stay with me here. On behind you, just staring. Get in here. Aha. And then there's this guy over here. Come on. Hey, look, he's got wheat. Go oh, that way, you cow. Come on. Look. Wheat. <laughs> ah, there we go. Now you care. Alright. PETA called. They're super unhappy with the stream. Yeah, that's probably fair. Uh, Alright, we got that. We got some wool. Uh, yeah, so we have two string. All right, we got our sweet cow farm. <laughs> Let's see if we can go find some spiders. In fact. Now we have baby cows. What the? Aha, they found us. Food, back in there. Uh, two and a half stacks, that's uh, not bad. I presume we want this uh, zombie flesh turning into food. Probably, yeah. Alright. 
So I can't remember whether we did the drying rack trick in the last... Uh, we've done it before, I believe. Like, turning yeah. zombie flesh into edible zombie flesh. Into monster jerky, yep. Yeah. Alright. Well then. Off to a phenomenal start. But now I want to go... We need some freaking... I want some... We need some strength, because I want to go down in this pit. But I also want to be able to get back out easily. <laughs> well, there's there's a hole sort of down to the... Uh, down into the ravine. Which is, you know, after you fell, how you got out. Uh... Ooh, I need some food. Which is over here. Uh, just one second. I need some food. Sorry, what was that? What are we doing? So you remember where you came out of the after you fell down the hole? Yeah. You could get down that way. That's true. Oh whoa. Oh, you did this already? Yeah, so I was mining for cobble. Oh. Fancy. Hmm. So there's some foam craft ore over there. Redstone down there as well. Yeah, redstone and I mean I guess iron is kind of what we want right now, so Yeah, we want to try and get some way of doubling ores again, and the easiest early game way of doing that is the grindstone. Lots of coal right here. We need quartz for the grindstone? Yeah, we only need three quartz though this time. We don't need to worry about quartz crystal, uh, quartz dust. I can see two. No, I got some iron. Way. I got some iron and some coal here, so I'll pick all this up. Gonna see if I can get across to the quartz. Sort of opens up into uh, quite a nice cave. Where did you get going to? Um, I am heading. Do you see where the quartz is on the other side of the ravine? Yeah. Uh, if you look to your right, there's a sort of hole just on our side. Oh yeah, okay. I've started going that way. Actually, started going down there, so you can see where I've uh, done the cobblestone. Yep, I found you. Being able to see your your viewpoint from here is quite useful. Ooh, is that a? Uh, I see. Is that iron over there? That like double iron? Yeah, so that's um, dense ore, so it's essentially double iron, yeah. Alright, there we go. So we need one more piece of quartz. Oh god, that was bad. I should know better than to do that. So this should give us two. Ooh, a lot more than that. Sick. Oh, I got one right here. Ah, cool. 
In fact, I got two more. And some copper. Excellent. I'm gonna just grab this copper, because why not? I'm here. So we can start we can start doubling ores at least now. Alright. So we can get iron picks and uh, start heading down to get some gold and things like that. Alright. Do, do, do. Uh oh. There's the way back up. Right here? Yes, found it. <laughs> yes, I did forget the uh, primary rule never dig straight down. Dig straight down, never dig straight up. Probably shouldn't dig sideways. Ooh, are there spiders? Now that it's nighttime. There's a spider way over there. Oh, there's a spider right attacking me. One more string. All right. Zombie. Ooh, I don't know if we did put lighting on the roof. No. We didn't. That we would be sensible. We can, yeah, though. Holy crap, look at all them zombies. So many zombies. All right. Yeah, go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. All right. So now what we can make, actually, let's put some of this stuff away. Is this? Not done yet. Put that in food. Uh, did you need food? Uh, no, I'm okay. I was just gonna put up some more, but it is not done yet, so it's fine. Uh, put that in there, and that in there, and this can go over here. Um. All right. So we were going to make a grinder, correct? A grindstone. Grindstone. Which is this. Oh, this is... This is... A mess. Stone. A wooden gear. Alright, so we need a wooden gear. Oh, do we need some actual stone? Hmm. Cook up some... Co um, some stone as well. Okay, I got the wooden gear, got the three of these, which means this can go here. Alright. One more piece of stone. Uh, and then we're going to have to take a, our first break of the day, guys. It's almost 10.30. There should be stone in the furnace. Yep. And boom. Well, that didn't work at all. Oh, I need five pieces of stone. What the? Why isn't that working? 
Uh, because the bottom two should be cobblestone. Oh, because they're cobblestone. Yep, remember you can shift click in to from any eye. Uh, it was sort of working. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Oh, you've done it. Alright, let's put that right here. And then... So I've, I've put metals in the chest here. I've handily labeled metals. Sweet. Uh, and then we need the handle, correct? Is this called a handle? Uh, crank, crank handle? Yep. Yeah, crank, which is just, yeah, a bunch of... Uh, we need more wood. Uh... Or bamboo. What's that? Whoa. That is a nice feature of translocation, uh, the translocators mod. Yeah. If you look at the ground, yeah. and press C, you get yourself a little crafting bench, and you can right click items into it and then look at it and press C to get the item back. Oh, what? If you, if you were to say, take that wood. Yeah. Press C to get the crafting grid, and yeah. then look at look at it and right click with a piece of wood. And then when you press C, you get a crafting table. Huh. I'm not going to bother doing that, because this wood is better used for making... But it's kind of useful when you damp it. All right, we have our grindstone. So we'll do this during the break, but really easily I'll take this iron ore, I'll stick it in here, and yeah, you'll see him. There we go. Turning, turning, turning. I think if I, oh sweet, I can actually. Hooray! I can we can watch you make the grindstone, or make the Yay. iron. So that's how that works, guys, and that will help uh, double our ore output. So from that twenty iron ore, we should get um, about forty iron dust, which each dust can be turned into one iron ingot. So that's awesome. Uh, but for now, we are going to take the first commercial break of the day. Uh, thank you to everybody who has stopped by and watched today. If you're new to the channel, uh, give us a follow if you would. Really appreciate it. And uh, I will be back in three minutes. Enjoy the fancy new commercial thing that's animated. Ooh. All right, guys, be back in just one second. And we are back. PC. Boom. All right, guys, how is it going? I have water. I have checked my voicemail, because I'm cool like that. And now I have some aluminum dust. Oh. Just one sec, guys. So I think I've ground down all our metals. Sweet. So we're not quite doubling. Um, there's a few people in chat pointed out it usually ends up around 1.5 times. But for early game... That's better than one. There we go. Put that rotten flesh up there. Monster jerky! So let's actually... We are indeed playing mods with Minecraft. We are playing the Direwolf 20 uh, 1.7 mod pack, uh, which you can go and find on the Feed the Beast launcher if you want. Holy crap, that's a lot of furnaces. Well, if you want iron quickly. Yeah, that's fair. Come on, spiders. Still don't see any. Hmm. 
This map is cool. Show mobs. Show animals. Journey map is uh, a really nice, really nice uh, mini map. Yeah, there's a lot going on there. Not sure if you saw it earlier in chat, but you can fly if you transform into a bat. Yes, I did know that. Uh, the other cool thing about uh, transforming into something like a bat is you can actually like travel along a single channel, like just one brick or one block. So it can make a um, better thing though. You can be than a bat. That w what's that? Uh, we probably don't have the skills to do it at the minute. I think there's a poll. Who will register death ten thousand on the loading ready run Twitch stream? Wow, how many deaths are we at? I feel like we just didn't we reason recently hit five thousand. Also, hooray for me having some votes. Although, yeah, clearly it will be Alex. <laughs> Six, 9,362. I mean, I could throw myself off a cliff like 640 times. Don't think I won't do it. We could do it. We could both do it. Oh, yeah, exactly, because we count. Oh, geez. Ow. Screw you. Stop hiding under our trees. Jerk. Just need some paper. Recent equals five months ago? Oh, well, shut up. Whatever. Yeah, load up Towerfall, exactly. It wouldn't take much. What up, Melon Monkey 101? It's a good name. Skeletons got overhauled in 1.7? Did they? I, I don't know. That's what somebody is saying. Whew. Oh, it needs to be water. That's why. Second. Ah, that's a creeper. Silly creeper. Got him. Make an axe. Cut down these trees. Uh, I just need some planks. We've got some wood. Jungle wood will do it. Oops. So if I go like this. So, you remember the ink huh. mixer that we made for Mistcraft last time? Yes. This is the new ink mixer. Oh, wow. That's pretty looking. The block looks sweet. This is probably a lot of work for what I'm about to do, but hey. What are you doing? There we go. This is even smaller than a bat. What the fuck? You can be a book? <laughs> yep. What the f- that is weird. <laughs> That's super <laughs> weird. 
They count as uh, they count as entities that you can kill. What the fuck? <laughs> Is that a Roomba? <laughs> <laughs> How much health does the book have? Uh, five. Five. What yeah. In the back. You can see right there. <laughs> wow, that's ridiculous. Don't you have to kill something to be able to morph into it? Yeah, so when you kill it, you take its skin. How do you kill a book, though? Um, I threw it on the floor, and then killed it. Oh. Huh. That's crazy. Uh, I can do it and make one up for you if you want. Dear Dr. James, you should put the name of the mod pack on the screen so people don't ask about it constantly. It's right there! <laughs> it's, it's, it's right here! Direwolf right 20 1.710 uh, mod pack available on Feed the Beast Launcher. I apologize if that was sarcasm, but. Dang, yo. It's right there! Here you go, kill this. <laughs> and now a book. I'm a book. A book with a sword. Deadly book. Does it do do you actually see me holding the sword? No? Oh. No, you are, you are just a book. There's only a, a few mobs that sort of hold mm -hmm. items. Uh, zombies are one of them. I think skeletons do. This is a brand new mod pack that we are playing uh, on stream. It's not a brand new mod pack. I mean, it's pretty new. It's probably a couple months old at this point. So. Yeah. Dear Dr. James, are you going to try to complete the map challenge? I don't... What is the map challenge? I was unaware there was such a challenge. Not where I wanted to put that sapling. Yeah, last week we blew up our monster world. Um, mainly just because um, 1.7.10 mods have started to come out. Um, and we were still playing 1.6. So I was like, eh, we should probably move on. Oh, and boy, how we blew it up. Oh, God, yeah. For the record, I said three nukes. The map challenge is where you build the largest possible map you lose if you crash the game. All right. We did that last week without trying. Yeah. I'm at 156. Well, I was going to watch Cam's Mi uh, Miko game from last night, but I rarely get to watch Lure Live, so I'll tune in while I can. Well, welcome. I am happy to have you here watching with us. All right, we should do something. Yeah, so we've got some iron now, so we could always go and grab some, try and grab some redstone and things, and some gold. Uh, get a bucket, get some lava going. Agreed. Plants. And boop, boop. Nope. Lots of wood now, so that's good. Oops. Yeah, 
Yeah, so we could do with getting some better materials. Guinea jeans, thank you for following. Appreciate it. Dear Dr. James, remember there is a volcano if you want lava. That's true. What's the next goal? A SOG mill? Says Mercano. Uh, yeah, SOG mill seems like a good place to start. Um, start by getting some power. That's true. SOG mill requires some flint, some iron, machine frame, which is a lot more iron. Capacitor, which is gold and copper and redstone, so... Yeah, so we need some gold and redstone. Alright, well, let's, uh... I'm gonna make myself an iron pickaxe. Yep, that seems like a good idea. Alright. I've got a couple stone pickaxes, so we'll use those as well. So we're not wasting. Uh, let's see, eat some food. We'll eat some jerky. We could probably do with um, getting some simple thinkers construct stuff as well at some point. Yep. Let's go to bed. Sleep at night. Um, do you want to make a couple of buckets? Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, I'll I'll make two. Okay, cool. There we then go. we can grab some lava. Go to bed. Are you going with the survivalist generators, Uno? Says uh, Roman Goro. Yeah, so survivalist generators are pretty good. They generate a lot of power. They're really slow. Uh, but it's not a bad it's not a bad thing to start with. Otherwise, regular furnace <laughs> generators are pretty good. Ufo Krana, if that's how you pronounce your name, that is a fantastic <laughs> idea. That is the only way to clearly get across the information that I need to. <laughs> Big blinking letters. Yeah, that works. Here's well, I'll just go like this. Direwolf twenty. There we go, and we'll just turn it. Hold on. Hold on, guys. There you go. Now nobody should ask about what we're using. Although that's scrolling the wrong way. There we go. <laughs> Perfect. All right, let's not do that anymore. <laughs> I can see no problem with this. Sword, sword will be handy. There we go. <laughs> James, what game is this? Lord Hosk. All right, uh, you got buckets. I have buckets. Uh, uh, you grab a bucket as well, just just in case. I'm gonna steal some wheat and make some bread, cause um, make the wheat into flour. Oh yeah. And then you can cook it rather than um, three wheat. Make some bread. Hello? Oh, just one sec. FedEx is here, guys. Just one second. Today, Hosk. Mm. 
Going well. It's almost the weekend. Alright, I'm back. Hey. Bread. Delicious bread. Uh, it's not a mystery box. It's from Wizards of the Coast, so I assume it's magic cards. Because <laughs> I don't know what else they'd send us. Uh, I've got my Fate Reforged uh, order in. Nice. I'm super excited for the pre-release this weekend. Yeah, the set uh, uh, just looks really good. I'm looking forward to it. Oh yeah, torches would be a good idea, I guess. Yep, you can make them out of uh, cobblestone stone as well. Oh yeah. We did just sell it, but in fact, we literally just, somebody just took a much smaller box of magic cards away from us. So. We haven't had Friday nights in a long time. It makes me sad. Guess what? We're filming tomorrow. Tomorrow we are filming the next episode of Friday nights. No, wait. Saturday. Today's Thursday. <laughs> Saturday we're filming the next episode of Friday nights. So, it will arrive very soon. Uh, are you making torches? Or am I making torches? Uh, I can make torches. All right, you can make torches. Can I open the box? No, I'm not going to open the box. Yo, uh, huh. I mean, I'll open the box and see what's inside, but I'm not going to tell you because I'm mean. <laughs> what is this? What the fuck? Uh oh. I hit the wrong person. Yes, I am pre-releasing. Sorry about that. M munch. Laxatives. I did not mean to do that. I hit the wrong button. Um, that was, in fact, a misfire. Uh, James, are you going to pre-release draft on Mitko? We will, although that's a couple weeks away. Mitko releases are a little later. Thank you, Lord Hosk. What do I think of the pre-release sealed format? One cons, four, four Fate Reforged, one seated. Uh, I love it. I think that's awesome. Um, I would not want to do that often because it's not really how the set is designed. Uh, that being said, it basically it will allow people to play with the new cards much more, and I'm super down with that. So I am very, very excited. Uh, what clan do I go for pre-release? I'll be Mardu. Okay, let's go mining. We have food, we have picks. Pulches. Sweet. You just want two Ugans? That's not greedy at all. Two Ugans? Why, why stop there? Yeah, why not just get a playset? Yeah, I could put it in four EDH decks then. Alright. Mardu? Yeah, Mardu. Uh, is the Ferris stuff we want? Um, we're mainly looking for gold and redstone at the minute. I think if we just go just down, yeah, we'll get to some gold level. a good place to be. James, I have no idea what you're talk what you're ranting about because I don't play magic. Well you should start playing magic. It's a very fun game that everybody should play. Oh dear god. I'll, pre right. 
I'll, I'll protect your bot, your gravestone. No. Well, that's a death. Count it up. <laughs> so you know what? Oh god, you had all the torches. <laughs> I had a number of torches. Alright, I'm coming back. I'm near that. Okay, folks, alive. Damn it. That was quite a cave system down there. So grabbing that sapphire is quite useful as well because you can make tools out of that. Sweet. Um, they are as fast as they're sort of like hard as iron, fast as diamond. Silver. Cobble. Is this a lake or something? Uh, I don't know. I was trying to figure that out. Uh... Oh, I just made it worse. Oh god. Here we go. Wait. What I will do is grab a bucket of lava. Ah. I hear fighting. You good? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just, yeah. A, just a couple arrows. No need to panic. Alright, are you going this way? I was just having a look what's around. There's some iron here as well. I'm gonna follow you, because you're the one with the torches. Uh, do you want... here you go. Have some torches. Sweet. Ooh! There's some redstone down there. I see redstone and, I believe, gold down there. Let's try and get down there. Torches go. Yeah. Uh, there's quite a few uh, creepers coming. Oh dear. All right. Well, there's one. Oh. Ah. Oh dear. Ha! Take that. Ah, stone. Get wrecked. Oh no, I'm getting wrecked. Ow. Ah! I can't. Ugh. Ow. Jesus. That. Why don't I want diamonds? I do want diamonds. <laughs> Ah, 
I'll take diamonds. Do you see diamonds? I haven't seen any diamonds. We're at... Oh, well, I mean, we're diamond level, so there could be some around. In James's bait. <laughs> uh, oh god. Creeper. I'm gonna see if I can turn up the brightness a bit. It's pretty dark. Oh dear. There we go. Hey, I have redstone. That's better. You guys should be able to see a little bit better now. Oh yeah, it automatically defaults to moody. Moody, yeah. Uh, James, you should quarry the volcano. Yeah, I could see us doing that. <laughs> Diamonds are lower in this pack, apparently. Yeah, he likes to fiddle about with things. Yeah, you guys should be able to see stuff a little bit better now. I turned up the uh, brightness. Uh, do you want to grab the a bucket of lava? Yep. Um, it's behind this uh, gravel. Grab the lava that's behind this gravel? Yep, so there should be lava right behind it. There we go. Later, Melon Monkey 101. Still a good name. Still a good name. Right, so what level is Diamond at then? Between 5 and 11. Oh god, I was looking right at a creeper there. <laughs> ah, sigh. I'll avenge you. Hey, he unearthed some redstone. So that's something. That was the spreadsheet that killed me there. <laughs> What's the orange mineral? It's copper. Uh, right here. Copper. I got some ruby. That's sweet. Oops. If it keeps going like this, I might get the nut 10,000. <laughs> Here, you're a ways away. <laughs> uh, where did we go? It was this way. Oh, that's a telly creeper. Uh oh. Oh dear. Got him. Whoa, what's that? Confusing powder. Sweet. All right. Uh, let's go this way, I guess? Yep, we want to be down at sort of, uh, seven-ish. I think it's probably a good level. Hmm. That's a coal. Shit, we need... Get rid of that water. Also, there's some gold here. Need to eat. Do do do. Uh, we're not. We're collecting the stuff we need right now. Uh, we're not going overboard with all the ores that we don't really need currently. So coal and gold and redstone and try to find some diamonds. Maybe I need to turn on my diamond finder. Oh, 
think we probably want to be about the same level as this lava, maybe a bit lower. Do you have any water? Uh, I've only got lava. Yeah. Uh, I can probably channel some water. Yeah, it's fine. I have a good feeling about... Hmm. I want to find some... Is the gold. I have a good feeling about down here. Well, lots of gold. We need diamonds though. Ah, gold's good. Gold's good, but I want diamonds. And I'm feeling. I've tended to find with this pack that Oops. Sorry. there's a lot of gold in it. There is a lot of gold in it. Uh, Alright, we want to be down a little further, right? Uh, yeah, we can cope with being down a bit further. Well, I'll go two over. What level are you at? I'm at five. Five. We want to be at about seven, looking at the spreadsheet. I don't, don't glance over the sheet, given what happened last time. <laughs> Alright, well, I'll go at six, then. And let's go this way. I have a good feeling here. Oh, more freaking gold. so much gravel. Oh dear, that's lava. <laughs> yeah, that, that that's lava. Alright, maybe this way was not the best way to go. <laughs> mm, right here. It's here. No, it's here. Oh, dark iron. Uh, yeah, I've got some gold. Some more redstone. Mm, redstone's good. And some. <laughs> oh, he's got it. <laughs> Boom! Diamonds. Nice. Uh, good times, good times. All right, let's dig around it, see what we got. Ooh, so, I think that just means you won, right? Yeah. Uh, it's only looking like about four. But hey, four I'll take. Is still pretty good. Yeah, four is not bad. Maybe underneath? No. Yeah. Oh, that's lava. Ow, 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 I'm on fire. No god. Run away. Are you gonna die? Oh god. Very probably. Yep. There we go. <laughs> oh, yeah. A lot of lava here. Alright. Four is not zero. You're correct. All right, let's mine up these diamonds. Swick! Four diamonds! I think that's my problem with starting a new pack. I get a bit ambitious and forget <laughs> that I haven't got all the stuff. Yeah, don't worry, James is there to sweep in to steal your experience. Yeah. I didn't mean to. <laughs> oh. More redstone. More dark iron. And we have bedrock. Oh god, there's a witch down here and a zombie. Where are you? 
Uh, I'm back in the ravine. Oh, why is that witch immune to fire? There you are. Yeah, there's a witch. You're in lava! <laughs> I don't know why she's immune to fire. Oh, great, a telecreeper. Oh, dear God. Where okay. Am I? Oh, I'm okay. You're up there. I don't like this anymore. Okay, this uh, is this way. What was. Uh, where are you? Uh, oh, okay. Down here. And in here. There you go. Aha! And it's there down go. there. Alright. Feel like we probably have enough stuff that we should probably get out of here. Um, yeah, uh, I think I can agree with that. Iron ore, berry bush, sure, why not? I know berry bushes are uh, pretty good. Yeah. Berries you can turn into uh, iron ingots. Alright, how the heck do we get out of here? Uh, around this corner was the... Ow! Jesus crap. Stupid water! Here we go. Oh, Jesus. Nope, nope. I'm running away. Jesus. Alright. Let me just heal up a little bit. <laughs> that witch is still there. Yeah, I know. My, my, my inventory is full. I don't know why I can't. Um, I guess we just run past. Yeah. The witch. Oh, nausea. Okay. So we want to get up there. Still here. Oh god. Ow. Ah. Ah. What is going? Where is our way out? <laughs> um. Not sure that it's that way. Yeah, I don't think it is. This would have been a good time to have done the, you know, sensible clutches on the left hand side. <laughs> I feel like this is the right direction? What the crap? Where? Yeah, I don't. Grab this iron. How much cobble have you got? 56. Well, more than that, probably. Uh, we could always nerd pull it. I don't... Where the heck... I feel like our way up is around here somewhere. I mean, we had a way up. Yeah, I mean, we got down. Uh, 
Nope, 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 nope. Creeper. Oh dear. What the crap? So... Our house is... This way. No, that's the meteorite, that's the witch hut. That's the time I died. No. House is this way, house is... Southeast of me. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. There it is. Did you find our way out? Or are we Ooh. just... No, I have no idea where the way out is. I'm just making a different one. <laughs> making a new way out? Yep. How did we lose it? I don't understand. Clicker heroes or riot? Are you kidding me, Adam? <laughs> we don't play clicker heroes anymore. Clicker heroes kind of fucked us over. Oh, there's the hole. There is the hole. Sweet. Just go straight up. Oh, hey, there's the. Uh, these. That's our way out right there. It's up there. Ah, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we knew where we were going. Yeah, totally. Don't let anyone think that we didn't. That's the way down. Aha! There is a, this is the way up. Yes! Did it! Oh, uh... We're free! Ow! God, it's night time. Oh, God! Ah! Ooh. Ah, skeleton. Sick. All these spiders mean string. Oh god. Oh god. Ah, Alright, <laughs> you, you barricade yourself in the house. <laughs> Has anything happened in the last five minutes? No, we... Uh, we found our way home. That's basically all that's happened. Alright, let's go to sleep. No, there are monsters nearby. Oh, I've gone. All the monsters. Where are you, monsters? Where? Where are the monsters? Oh, there's one over here. It's a terrifying hat. What the f Fuck. Also, damn it, monster, get out of our shit. Hooray, we're sleeping. Hey. I missed a sub? Who the heck subbed? Who subbed? I see nothing. I missed a sub notifier and everything. Selenes92 has subscribed! Hey! Thank you so much for the sub! I'm gonna write down your name so I remember to add it to the sub wall, which we need to make at some point today. S E L E. Alright. Selenes92 sub hype!
Actually, hell, this is my sign right here. Sub height! I still have the sign. Turn down and or up for sub height. Turn in the direction you choose. Yes. All right. Uh, All right, so we have lots of stuff. I'm grinding up the things. Boop. Boop. <laughs> I added a lot more things. Uh, Ender fragment. Interesting. Ruby can go in there. That can go in there. And that can go in there. It's probably worth setting a chest up for like mob drops or something as well. For like uh, string, rotten flesh, spider eyes, that sort of thing. Yeah, I can do that. I should get in the bag? No, the bag, that's... no. I don't think I'm gonna get in the bag. Alright. We now I have... I think we're still a ways away from that fishing rod as well. We now have a mob drop. Let's take that, and that, and that. Yeah, the bag is old school. You've tried everything, Adam, staying up, including staying up till 1am playing Hearthstone. Are you, like, super into that game now? I was watching you stream it the other day. It seemed... It seemed like you were enjoying it, so that's good. It's a fun game. Uh, I don't play it as much. Take coal out of the miscellaneous. I feel like it can go in like gems and dust for now. That is a point. Why am I sort of sitting here um, grinding everything? It, I mean, it's very therapeutic uh, when we can start thinking about making a um, sag mill and stuff to do the grinding yeah. for us. Constructed is way more fun than you thought? That's sweet. Than that. Oh wow! We're only one death away from uh, from a th uh, from 200 deaths in Minecraft. That's exciting. We're gonna need a bigger skull. Uh, what does my skin look like? It's this. Me wearing my monkey hoodie. All right. Ooh, wait, we can make our uh, rope ladder now. Yeah, I think you've got the enough string there. And in a second we will have the last piece of flint to make the sargmel. Huh. Shift clicking is not working from uh, any eye. Uh, you're probably missing something. What are you trying to make? The rope ladder. I have the sticks and I have the rope. You got enough string? Yep, 
I got six string and lots of sticks. Uh, do you want to throw it here? I'll give it a go. Hmm, this is weird. Oh well. It's not exactly a difficult recipe to pick no. up. No! I will make it the old fashioned way. Hooray! Wait, there's eight of them? Yeah, they're not as good as they were. No. Oh. How far but down? They're still pretty good. How far down does it go? Let's find out. I think it's about. Oh, yeah. it, it goes down eight. Oh, it cheats all of them. Oh. Huh. I remember rope ladders being way better before. Oh, good God, and I fell to the very bottom. <laughs> hey. Yeah, the rope ladders were a hell of a lot better before. Um, do you want some blocks? Uh, we sh I should be able to get back up with the way that we did this. At least you landed in in water. Yeah. Uh... Oh god, oh good god, no, go away. Bye, Adam. Hooray! I think I'm gonna make it back or alive. Hurrah! Uh, Here's my dumb rope ladder. Huh, rope ladder not as good as it used to be. That's sad. What a waste. What a waste! It's, it's still pretty good. You can, um... I mean, you're laddering down from somewhere rather than... Oh crap, it fell down. Shit, I thought I picked it up there. So you've got two options. You can either jump down and get it. What's the other option? <laughs> Leave it. <laughs> I like that option better. Bye, sheep. Ah, oh, the sheep will go and get it. Yeah. Oh. Well, I, I, I might have killed the sheep, but sure. He'll go get it. <laughs> Alright. Right, should we get some uh, better... Something better than this grindstone going? Agreed. So, we should have enough iron and gold... And redstone now to make a sag mill. A sag mill. Uh, I know how to pronounce it. All right. Do, do, do. All right. So sag mill requires three flint. All right, we need to make the basic capacitor, which is flint is on the floor behind you. There you go, you've picked it up now. Cool. Uh, I need some iron. Actually, I need a lot of iron. Actually, I think because we need to make this, which requires iron bars.
Hmm. Yeah, the shift click into any eye is not working. It's annoying. Hmm. All right. So. I wonder if. I wonder if the there was an any eye fix. I think in uh, one one point zero point three. I wonder if it broke the shift clicking. Do we have? Have we? No, I need to cook up some copper. I guess. There. All right. Let's make. Uh, it would probably help if I put those metals away there. All right. Let's make this. Right. We can't. Do that. Do that. Do that. That. All right, we have that. We need gold nuggets and copper. And there's our basic capacitor. All right, so we go like this, and like this, and like this, and like this. All right, we got our sog mill. Cool. Um, so the next thing we need is a means of powering it. Yep. Um, so thermal expansion we did last time with all the we've done before with steam dynamos and stuff. Yep. Uh, extra utilities generators are a pretty good way of doing things. Um, as people have been pointing out, the survivalist generators are a pretty good early game power source. They don't produce much in the way of RF per tick, but they are incredibly efficient. Okay. Uh, so a survivalist generator is relatively easy to make. Yep. Cobblestone, iron, redstone, a furnace, piston, and two pieces of iron. Yeah, if so. we can make two of them, that's a little bit better for us. Okay, I will make two of them right now. Uh, I need a little bit more cobble. Okay, we got that. And what else did we need? Two furnaces. Hello? Yo. Hey everybody, Ray is here. <laughs> I decided to watch James play instead of stream. Which got DDoSed. Wait, what? Your stream got DDoSed? That's no good. I don't even know how that would work. Uh, alright. So... Oh, wait. Instead of a stream, which got DDoSed. Oh, alright. Uh, I need six. So you need two like that. And... Alright. This. And this. This and this. One more piece of redstone. Boom. Two generators. Alright. Where the heck do I. No? Hold on. Just one sec, guys. Uh, I'm just gonna go to this so you don't see stuff. Because apparently. Hello? Hello! Yo! I hey. 
it, was, it I guess it closes those after a while if you're not active on them. <laughs> Go back to full screen here, oh, which I should be able to do just by going like, no, like that. Perfect. There we go. Back to game. Back to game. There we go. James, did you get an answer as to if I'm still authorized highlighter? It's no big deal if I'm not, but I won't spend time. Oh yeah, I was gonna ask Graham about that. I will uh, ask Graham today. I don't, I don't dig too deeply into the uh, Twitch backend because I don't want to mess anything up. That's kind of his area. So, all right. So, where are we putting the generator and sagmel? Um. Okay. The other thing we probably want is a means to just store the power. Um, a leadstone energy capacitor is probably an easiest thing at the minute. Okay. Uh. I think I think we've got some lead. Oh, we've only got two. We need more than that. Well, we know where we're to, where to find it. <laughs> or we can make a basic capacitor bank. Whoa, what From the heck is this? Andrio, which just needs a lot of a lot of copper and iron. What? So what am I looking at? A capacitor bank? Uh, the basic capacitor bank. Uh, not the deprecated ones. Oh, okay. Basic capacitor bank. So we need... Four basic capacitors, four iron, and a block of redstone? Yep. Okay. So I need... That seems doable. Do we have four copper? We have three. And we have this. So let's do this. There we go. Let's cook up that... Oop. Um. All right, so we need some gold. Yep, we've got plenty of gold. Yep, and we'll need some nine, and then one, two, three, four, and I'll need some iron. Oops. Mm. Mundane ring. Interesting. Mundane ring? Oh, right, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Thorncraft added um, a load of sort of little things. They call them ball. It calls it baubles. So you can have like rings, amulets, and a belt. All right, we got. I got it. Cool. Uh, do you want to make a separate little house? For... We probably should. It's either that or a basement. Um, house or basement is fine. Yeah, let's just so make... want to go up and... Um... You should play Minecraft. It's super fun. Alright, sorry. What are we doing? Uh, where do you want to start putting, like, machines and things? I don't know. I guess, yeah, we need to... 
Um, I mean, this is probably only going to be vaguely temporary. Yeah. Oh no, you fell in the cow hole. Um, let's just add on like a outdoor hut. Yeah. Um, should we make it a bit prettier though? Yeah, I'm trying to think of a way to make it look cool. Um, so you could grab one of these. Yep. Build on a floating island? Uh, we're not going to do that. Oh, the chisel. Yep. Uh, let's also go to sleep. Doop. Hey, Mamo. How is it going? Sleep works, too. Uh, alright. So... I guess just cobblestone? Yeah, we've got some marble as well. That's tr How much marble do we have? I've got 12 here. Um, cobblestone with light panel, that's kind of cool. Colored cobblestone. Ooh, I like the light blue co cobblestone. Let's take some light blue cobblestone. And you gave me some marble. What the crap? Hey, giant slime. <laughs> oh, that's not... Uh, at least it's not king slime. Holy crap, he's got a lot of health. Jesus. Not anymore, he doesn't. He didn't even drop anything. We're gonna get a lot of blue slimes. They'll spawn up there on the uh, slime island. Right. Um, Alright, so... Crap, I don't know what... What I actually want to do here. I mean, that's the that's the cobblestone with the light panel. Yeah, I have the blue cobblestone, which actually looks kind of cool. The light panel? No, the light panels don't join up. James is not finishing in 15 minutes. James goes longer now. James will be taking a break in 15 minutes. He will also stop talking in the third person. Um... Creeper panels feel like quite nice, like, door decoration. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Sort of do this. I think for now... Let's do... So far, we haven't really done too much different that's that's different in this pack. Getting them away. We're sort of getting everything situated at the minute. Yeah. 
the next big thing, actually, what we'll probably do when we get back from the break is set up the, I want to set up the sub wall, so. Um. Ooh, car there's carpenter's blocks in this mod? Yeah, Ooh. that's what I've just got. Carpenter's blocks are sweet. So you guys can, so check this out, guys. Boop. You can do like you can do like a proper roof. Yeah. Fatteram has just subscribed. Oh, I missed the sub note. I haven't actually I've barely seen it yet. Fatteram, Fatteram. Hold on, I gotta write down your name so I remember to put it on the board. Fat. Uh, sub hype. Let us welcome the newest sub with all the spot the dogs. Let's spot the dog him. Yeah, this... You know what? I'm gonna actually kill this, uh... Cow with the music box. <laughs> Come here. Just want his hat. I just want him to not be... It's just annoying. Ooh. That's cool. That's just putting the wedge in the corner. Yeah, let's do that all the way up then, because that looks sweet. Storm count of two! Let's not have that. Alright. Why are we spotting? To welcome our newest sub. Oh no. I'm sure there's some sort of carpenters. There we go. Something for this area. Damn it. Damn it. <laughs> there we go. Oh, I'll go make some more cup, uh, some more wedges. Need to make some more blue cobblestone. Yes, because you spotted a new sub. That's exactly right. What just was that? Was that six? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. Cobblestone. Uh, I've got a stack here. Sweet. You want to make the blue cobblestone? Yep. Finish off those sides. Uh, there's half a stack there. All sweet. Let's uh, let's do this. And...
the crap? Where was that? I heard an explosion. Oh, it may be creeper plant seeds. Creeper plant seeds? Madness. Yeah, it's uh, Pneumatocraft. Right now, I said. right now we are just sort of setting up our initial little base here. Um, yeah, leave this big window open. We'll just make this a big window. Uh, okay, if you got some more cobble to color that lot? Uh, I do not. I am out of cobble. Do you have much cobble left? I have six. <laughs> Maybe we should make a cobble generator. Lure MTG is in fact today. Yeah, it's starting at three o'clock. Starts at new, it's new time today. Um... Do we want to set up, really quickly set up the, uh, the generator and stuff in here? And then we can finish all this off. Um, yeah, sure. So, is there any, what's the Plunk best the order? Down. Sorry? Plunk the capacitor down somewhere. Boop. Uh, put the sarg mill on the right hand side of it. And if we just put the survivalist generator on the top and left. Like that. Yep. And then, if you open up the capacitor... Yep. It has a bit of an interface. It does. And in the right hand side there's like a configure I.O. Yep. So you need to set the top and the left to be input and the right to be output. Hmm, that's cool. Alright. That's done. Uh, and you can do something very similar with uh, the Sarg Mill. So if we get a chest, put the chest on top of the Sarg Mill, you can actually set aside to be both input and output at the same time. Oh, sweet. Huh. Uh, I've got some chests here. Did you... What happened to all of our wood? <laughs> Um, I've probably got it. Oh, you were using it to make the carpenter's box as well, right? I've made some chests, I've got got some here. Oh, sweet. Mm. So, pull. So, set it to pull, I assume? Um, you can set it to do both. Push and pull. Yep. And then we just need some power. I assume coal. Uh, yeah, I'll go and get a stack Sweet. of coal. That's half a stack. If you want to put that in the top generator. Yep. It is filling up. Yep, and the Sarg mill is filling up as well. Um, no? Oh, it's working. Yeah, I guess it is. Yep, it, it, it's working. It'll be slow. Very, very slowly. Hooray! And what we can do is we can make the Sarg mill uh, better uh, by giving it something to use as a grindstone. Oh, really? Sweet. Yeah. Throw some flint in it. There's a sort of uh, box on the right hand side. So if you hover over the shift, uh, if you hover over the flint and hold shift while it's in the sarg mill, it's a grinding ball for it. Oh, interesting. That's cool. 
So we're basically reducing the amount of power it takes and we're increasing the output. And yeah, for the minute that's going to be slow because we've only got uh, two survivalist generators on it. Yeah. Okay. We're only, we're only generating ten. Well, it is up and running, so that is something. Yep. Perfect. All right. Well, we got that set up just in time for our second quick break of the day. So we're just going to take that really quick, and then when we come back, uh, we need to build this. Uh, we need to build the sub wall. We got to get that back going because there are two new subs, and all you other fantastic people who have subbed uh, during my stream since we developed the sub wall a couple months ago. Uh, we need to get you back up there. So. Um, I will be back in a couple of minutes, and we'll, uh, I guess we're going to have to figure out how we're going to do this. <laughs> and, yep, uh, yep. alright, see you guys in just a couple of minutes. Uh, sure, sure. Yeah, and we could always move it if we need to. Okay.
Good to go. We are back. Boom. All right. What madness are you doing? No, uh, just a couple of deaths. I figured we were running low on cobble. That's fair. Could have easily automated this, but sometimes you just like to do things the old-fashioned way. <laughs> Alright, so. Ooh. It's looking good. Let's go add to this. Put some glass in this window. We should. I will go cook some glass. Actually, we should have some glass. I don't know if we have a lot, though. We have three, so let's go get more. What up, Foxmar? How's it going? Doing the old digging by hand there. Yep. Well, digging by torch. Have a shovel. All right. Woo, a sapphire shovel. That's fancy. Dear God, that's so much faster. <laughs> It's the same speed as, like, diamond, I think. Uh. Hey, Fox Ma. Oh, I uh, plan to use it. There's some down here as well. Oh, sweet. Um... It is an hour earlier than normal, and that's because that is when the new... That's the new start time for the magic stream. Three o'clock. I'm digging the uh, the earlier start times. Yeah, they're. I think they're... They are pretty good. Definitely, uh... Definitely help out those of you in the... The Europe's. Yeah, it means I can pretty much watch a, a full GPLP on a Wednesday now. Yeah, because they start at noon, so that's like 8 o'clock your time? Yeah, yeah, 8 o'clock. Yeah, that's sweet. I have another 40 cents. That's a lot. Alright, well let's just cook all that up. That should be fine. Grab that marble as well while I'm here. Yes, the the numerous and sundry Europe's. Oh, picture in picture does not like me being underwater though. <laughs> Yeah, I'll need to get that installed for next week. All right, what glass? It's pretty neat. What glass do we want to use? Quite clear glass, bubble glass. Soul glass. Borderless glass. That doesn't sound ominous at all. Yeah, no, not at all. Uh, this, this glass sounds kind of cool. Let's go see what this looks like. Uh, did I use marble blocks? Hmm. 
Oh yeah, that's nice. That looks good. Oh, that looks good. New mod pack, we are playing uh, Direwolf 20. So what class is that? Is that just the... Um... It's the clear borderless. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Gotta have a cow pit. True story. That should actually be just enough glass. It's a moosh pit. Uh. Terrible. There we go. Nice. Yeah, looks good. More marble. Ooh, need more. Oh, I have some actually. Yeah, I like the uh, carpenter's blocks are sweet. I like them a lot. Hmm. Say the other thing you can do with them, uh, but I don't know if you've seen. If I do this and I make a pressure plate, I can. You can color the pressure plate. Oh, that's cool. When is Will Wheaton putting us on tabletop? I don't know. There was actually talk about doing that, but um, I don't think it was uh, quite in their budget for this season, unfortunately. It's expensive to uh, bring us all down there for the afternoon, so. <laughs> dear Dr. James, maybe you should build an XP. Oh, dear God. That was probably very loud. Uh. Whatever happened there that was loud and then went very quiet. Do you still hear me? I can still hear you. Yeah. Okay, that was me knocking your mi the mic that I used to talk to you off the table. <laughs> so, yeah. Sorry guys, just one second. I got like 30 million things on my freaking phone going here right now. New sub wall is coming up. We're gonna do that very soon. Oh god, your piece the piece of wood over here is on fire. Oh right, yeah, I can fix that. There's a way to edit these, and I've forgotten what the tool is. What are you trying to do? Uh, there's a way to edit the pressure plates. So that you can control, sort of, um, what kind of things will trigger them. Yeah, cool. So that they don't end up being triggered by like mobs and things like that. Yeah, carpenter's hammer. I had the carpenter's chisel.
There we go. There we go. Only activate for players. Sweet. All right, let's build this sub wall. This whole right. like portable this is weird. Oh, that was not what I wanted to do at all. Freaking out. The carpenter items are part of the mod, yeah. Yeah, we'll get to the roof in a minute. This is a machine room. It's not as important to make it all fancy and stuff for now. So, let's assume that's the floor. Something like that for the entrance. Oh, wow, you can climb up these. They act as, like, stairs. That's cool. That looks kind of cool. Yep, just need to replace that one. Sweet. That's pretty cool. Sweet. We, could swap, we could swap them to uh, this marble as well when we've got the floor properly in. Yeah. Uh, there are corners in Carpenter's blocks, yes. There's a whole bunch of stuff in Carpenter's, actually. Actually, I should probably take a look at it so you guys can see. Carpenters. So you have the wedge slope, the oblique interior slope, the, uh, this is like a triangle, exterior slope, prism, wedge, stairs, so you can make stairs out of basically anything, which is kind of cool. There's also just the regular block and the barrier, which is, I think, just like a fence. There's carpenters' doors and beds and all sorts of stuff, so. Come on. Oh no, I had it a second ago. What are you trying to do? Uh... There we go. Something like that. Oh, that's not it at all. I'll figure it out. <laughs> Try to get something in that corner. Let's go ahead. Boop. All right, let's build the sub wall. Yep. Let's get going on this. All right, so to do so, I'm actually going to quickly make. Uh, do we have wood? I have a little bit of wood. There's wood in this chest that I'm just dumping my stuff into. That is what I was going to do. I was going to make a chest in here and put all of the stuff I had into it. 
You can also cycle through the ramp shapes with shift and mouse wheel. Alright, so... Game mode C. And game mode C. Did that work? Yep. Okay. So, what we've done is we've put ourselves in um, creative mode because obviously we are nowhere near being able to actually build all of this stuff with the materials that we have. However, um, I don't care. I just want this thing to exist so I can put your guys' name up on the wall if you guys decide to subscribe during my show. So we need to figure out where this is going to go. And I'm actually thinking like right over here, to be honest. Yeah, I, w I was wondering whether sort of over this way so that you look out of the window at it. Yeah, that is true. Like, it needs to be pretty close to my or the base. We could build it up on, like, this. Um, like, I like making it look a little, like, kind of cool. Like, the wall, in, like a big wall behind it. We're not going to build it at the volcano, because then I have to go to the volcano every time that somebody subscribes. <laughs> I think we won't be able to see it when, from the base and stuff. Yeah. I mean, this over here is sort of front entrancey. Yeah, like it's sort of like clear off all this crap. Yeah, I can I can clear this quicker uh, if I do this. All this stuff clearing out. Sorry. Whoa! What? What the heck was that? Uh, this is an item from Britannia. Uh, I figured if we wanted this clearing quickly... Holy crap. Okay. I'll pick up all these dumb seeds that are replanting themselves. Uh, the other thing to do... You also need to make a trash bin for all this crap. I just grabbed a quick magnet as well, that'll help pick up all the seeds easier. Actually, you just go like this, right? Yeah, this makes them all go away. Okay. I just realized that there is no music playing. Hold on one second. We're going to play some music. Okie dokie. So, how do we want to do this? So, what do we want the computer again? Uh, I think we want, like, the screen, like, here, like, against, like, I think we want to make, like, inlay it inside of a, a wall. I'm not sure what we want to make that wall of. So, what, the computer there... And sort of monitor there. Yeah, I think that's basically how we had it. Yep, and then we had the cabinet and the chest. Right, so let's find the cabinets. And. Oh, I guess we had the anvil. Yep. We had a... Was the anvil here? Chest? Oh, 
Is that how we had it? Um, I think we had the anvil just ahead of it, but... Uh, the anvil Having can... it there is fine. We are cheating the subwall into existence, yes. Uh, because it will take too long to not have it cheated into existence. I feel like it was bigger than this before. It was 7x4. Make it bigger. Yeah, I think we need to make it bigger. Can we make it... wider, or no? Yeah, yeah, we can make it wider as well. Sweet. I think we just go one... I think we go nine. <laughs> wow, James is such a cheater. Whatever, Fugi. I don't you know. You're not my dad. Unless you are, in which case... Dang. That's weird. I hit a, a width limit? Oh, maybe you can't go wider. Really? So 8 is as wide as you can go? Yeah, it looks like. Because uh, this, this to the side hasn't... Yeah, it's not connecting. Oh man, if we could go 16 by 9, that'd be sweet, but it doesn't look like we can. Uh, hmm. Well then, I guess we want to take this end off. I guess maybe just go... Can we go higher? Yeah, it can go higher. It can go higher, it just can't go wider. Well, maybe not. That's not oh. connecting. Oh, that's as high as I can go. Never actually uh, tried to make a monitor this, uh, this big. Ooh, actually, could we have a separate, could we do a too high monitor up here that says subwall in really big letters? I guess we would need a, another computer for that, eh? Yeah. Oh, we could do. Possibly not out of uh, lapis blocks, but... We'll do that, and do we have the, what's the, uh, do we want those? Oops. Exterior slopes, it's not right, is it? How about something like that? <laughs> oh dear God. Um, it needs to be... Obviously, I need to move it over. Yeah. I think that needs to go into the wall that we put this behind. Uh, yep, yeah, sure. I'm trying to think of what we want to do. Is this... How do we get the... 
fill in these areas. Uh, grab a carpenter's hammer because you need to rotate it with that. Carpenter's hammer. Oh, or that works. So, like that, but back one. Uh, yes, and up one. And up one. But yeah. Uh, actually, does it need to be? Um, no, it doesn't need to be back one. That one's fine. Just up. Up. Up one is fine, because then we'll build a wall, big wall around it, and that will be, like, so the computer is inlaid into the wall. What do we want to make the floor here out of, guys? The answer is diamonds, always diamonds. Eh, diamonds will probably not actually look that good. Obsidian? Ooh, obsidian on the floor could look kind of cool. Uh, have a look at some of the chisel obsidian. Yeah. That as well. It makes me think, uh... Ooh, lava with a glass cover. Ooh, I kind of like that. Ooh, yeah, what if we go one deep, one below, and then do, like... And then we do glass. We could do the borderless glass. Like that. You could also maybe look at like glowstone glass. I feel like with the uh, with the lava right below it. Hmm. Although glowstone glass for the carpenter's blocks could be kind of interesting. Yeah. Ah, oh. I need to break it and place them back down. That's annoying. Let's see how they look over here. Oh, doesn't look like I can do glowstone glass on the carpenter's blocks. Oh, right, okay. That's, That's sad. Eh, I think this looks kind of cool. Oh, it looks cool. Uh, I don't, actually, I don't know about the carpenter's blocks, but I'll figure something else out for those, I think. I do like the, the lava floor, though. Hmm. <laughs> Do obsidian for the carpenter's blocks? Yeah, I could see that for sure.
Only a bit of lava. Sorry? It's only a bit of lava, yeah. what are you worried about? There we go. Cool. Yeah, lava stone. This stuff's sweet. Oh, shit. How the hell did that happen? Oh, did you put a piece of glass in there? Somehow, yeah. Alright, there we go. Ooh, that looks cool. Although it's not working on the... Does a lava stone work on the carpenter's blocks? I do not know. Actually, put the let's put the lava stone um, below the carpenter's blocks. Uh, it does work. It looks kind of poopy though. Yeah, it's also yeah, it doesn't look great from the back. You can sort of what's that called? It. Lava stone? Uh, lava stone. Black lava stone. What I'm wondering is... Putting it here. Oh yeah, that looks sweet. Look Also wondering how. Ah, oh, that doesn't work. Yeah, I need to break these. Oop. That doesn't work either. Oh, we're just getting rid of the uh, carpenter's blocks. Uh, you have to because it doesn't look like you can replace. I'm gonna put carpenter's blocks down again. We just. Whoops. We just need something cool to put on there. Oops. Let's, uh... Let's make that like that. Alright, so we need to do the carpenter's blocks again, and I'm thinking obsidian. Could be kind of cool. Oh, I have them on my hotbar. So, here, here, here. How about... Those as well? Ooh, that looks kind of cool. That is bloodstone brick. Yeah, let's do that. That looks sweet. Also, uh, what's the command to turn the rain off? No rain. Damn, that didn't work. Uh, you should be able to do it through any eye. Oh yeah, that's right. Why won't you? Uh, hmm. That doesn't work. Oh god, what are you doing over here? Trying to put the. We do need. Oh, what the heck is this? <laughs> I also need to fill this hole up. There we go.
So maybe maybe I can't put things in your carpenter's blocks. Oh really? Yeah, can you fill those? What's it called? There you go. Oh, sweet. Hmm. Maybe it keeps track of um, who placed the wedge. Alright. That's looking pretty sweet. Cheater. <laughs> All right. Um, what we do, so now what we need is this looks super sweet. Although what we need to do really quickly is get rid of this and probably. Needs something sort of behind it, I think. Yeah, well, what I want to do is put a wall basically out to here. Like, build a wall like this. Yep. Um, but of not this. I need a different block. I just don't know what to make it. Factory blocks, eh? Ooh. one of those three? I like the top one. This one? That is rusty metal plate. Sweet. Rusty metal plate. Oops. to eat. Yeah, perfect. We are building the epic sub wall. Yes. So now the question is, do we want it to in to actually build around the subs? I feel like let's see what that looks like. block anyway. Make an indent behind subs and fill it with light blocks. Subs is glowstones. Yeah, I could see changing the sub blocks to something that lights up a little bit more. That uh, looks pretty good. Yeah, it looks cool. To give that wall a bit of definition.
backlight instead of, uh... Dark steel anvil. Does that do, do the same thing? Probably, right? Yep. Could use something like these. Where are you? Behind you. Oh. Ooh. That could look kind of cool. Probably the darker so. ones. Back how do you backlight though? Well, these are lit. These are these yeah. Are... Yeah, let's these try it with a dark one. Oh. So these are inverted blue lights. Uh, inverted blue lamp. That looks kind of cool. Uh, do you want to make it dark? So you can see what it looks like in the dark. Yeah, it looks sweet. Alright guys, what do you think? What do you think of the new subwall? Lure logos down the side. It's not super easy to do lure logos in Minecraft. They look kind of weird. Yeah, they need to be sort of pretty big. Yeah. To be any... I don't know, I think that looks kind of sweet. But anyway. The red blocks are too colorful? I could see that. Everything else is very dark. I could see going with something a little less colorful. Uh, let's. This doesn't work to. Yeah, no, you can't. Um, something a bit less colorful. Uh. How about something like those? Yeah, that could work. So these are... Oops, uh, they are factory blocks, they are wireframe... You just dropped one, so I can oh, use that okay. one. Well, there's also this one, which is rusty purple block with gold plating, which actually looks pretty neat. Ooh. Yeah, that might look better. You want to drop one of those? Yeah. Yes. There you go. Thank you. All right. What do you guys think? The one on the right or the one on the left?
Right, right, right. Okay. Right it is. Yeah, it is a shame that it doesn't... the textures don't connect with Carpenter's box. Yeah. Oh. I would say... Oh, no. Still looks cool. This looks pretty cool. Alright. Um... Let's get a bunch of books. Oh, I suppose I have to get the code down, haven't I? Oops, book. Uh oh, that chest is not going to open there. Ah, uh, yeah. It needs to be forward. Right, okay, well then let's put the chest where the anvil is. Oh yeah, and put the anvil. Is that what we did in that but I don't I don't really remember, but that's it should work, so. Helps if I can type in the uh, pastebin code, right? I think you should expand the floor so it's the same size as a wall. Yeah, you might be right. Uh, yeah. want to go to there. This is probably where this should be. Lava under there. Last was that again? <laughs> uh, I'll come and fix it in a second. I think it was borderless. Build this one. Sweet. All right, and then we need more carpenters blocks. Want the um, little dots on this, on this glass? Um, maybe not. Maybe the better glass is there's a better glass than that. Yeah, I'm thinking this stuff. Uh, if I go like this, 
Yeah, that's better. Yeah, that's way better. Sweet. Definitely do that. Um... What's this called again? Oh, uh, the stuff we were using, it was a factory block. Rusty purple block with gold plating. Yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yep. Nice. There we go. Nice. There we go. There is the sub wall. Yeah, I've, it makes it easier, Makano. Book, book, book. That is probably because I haven't tested this code in 1.7. The subwall cannot be that wide, unfortunately. This is actually as wide as it, it appears the monitors will connect properly. Uh, you could put another metal block behind the anvil. What's behind the anvil right now? Oh, yeah, what we could do is... Um, what was this from again? Factory block. Rusty metal plate, I think that's what this was. Do that. Fill it in. That's probably better. Short round 20 2099 has just subscribed. Short round 2099. Thank you for subscribing. I will get your name up on the wall as soon as it works. <laughs> Rake X has just subscribed. Short round 2099 and Rake X. Let me write your names down so I don't forget them. Short round 2099 and rake. I assume that's how, I'm pr how you pronounce that, but I don't know. I could be wrong. R A I C. R A I C. Yeah. Rake X. Sub hype. Thank you guys so much for the subscriptions. Really appreciate it. You guys, your support means so much to us and we really love it. And um, yeah, welcome to the new subs. Let's give them some spot the dogs. Hey! Excellent. It's working. All right, let's get some more books. Uh, for anybody uh, who had their name up on the wall before, uh, I will uh, put all your names up there um, before next stream. I don't want to spend a bunch of time. Short round 2099 and James, if possible, could it be without the X on the subwall? It absolutely could be without the X. Done. There you go. And wait for it. Hey, there we go, guys. Short round 2099 and rake. Again, I just assume. So, yeah, so um, I will make sure to, um, am I going to rebuild the beta sub wall? No, probably not.
I probably will not. All right. Yeah, this is a private server. Yep, all, everybody who is subbed um, prior and was on the sub wall, your name will go up on the sub wall. I will do that be before next week. Um, I just, there was like, there's probably like 25 or 30 names, so I don't want to go through all of those right now on stream. It's take me too long. All right, there we go. We got our sub wall back. That's exciting. Yep, and I've posted the code in to chat as well if people wanted to have a look at it. So what I will do is... Me and Graham will be drafting at 3 o'clock, two hours from right now. Not a problem. I will gladly leave out any letters that you guys want me to leave out. <laughs> if I actually save that before rebooting. we got one more hour in my show and then um, there will be a short hour long break where I can go get some food and then I will be back. Spell lub subs in the lava. I mean we could but that's too much work. <laughs> Alright. Alright. I think that is good for now. Yep, I think that's probably the most creative thing I've ever done. <laughs> Alright. Game mode. Back to normal mode. All your stuff. I have an empty inventory. Yeah, I got rid of all my stuff. Are you back into regular mode? Yep. Alright, let's get my stuff back. Oh, I appear to have an inventory full of seeds. Well, lava you go. Oops. Dear Dr. James, for drafting it, can you do a flashback draft? I think there's only one old set available right now, and it's... I can't remember what it is, but it's a set that we're probably not super familiar with, and we don't really like doing those, just because we suck at them. <laughs> <laughs> so, we'll see. That's sometimes what makes the draft, though. It's triple Odyssey. Yeah, I have absolutely no idea how to draft Odyssey. Wouldn't even know where to begin. So, we'll, we'll see. What the... They're, oh, God. There are creepers in our pit. Um... Mm. Hang on, oh, let's go for that sword. Mm. Alright, I got the Tele Creeper. And my sword died, so. <laughs> Ooh, fancy. Oh god, don't kill our cows. Yay! Uh, Alright, it looks like our sag mill is done. Yep. So, so we've got a load of dust. Yeah, we got lots of dust. So, let's start cooking that dust up. But obviously we don't want to do it with the furnaces. One thing we can do it with is an alloy furnace, which is another Ender IO. Uh, alloy. Thing. Yep. So I need, wow, three furnaces, 
four blocks, four iron ingots, a cauldron, and a machine chassis, which requires a whole lot more iron. So a lot of iron, stone, and stuff. So let's go make all that. All right. So need a whole bunch of that, and this, and this. And wow, we have like, we have no stone. <laughs> oh, I've got load here. Oh dear. Uh, but put some cobble back in the uh, chest. Along with all this wood. Do you have any more cobble? That's still. Um, there's some unchiseled, well, there's some chiseled stuff. You can into cobble. Oh, yeah, that's true. Otherwise, we've got a cobble can outside. That's true. Okay. Let's... Three furnaces. A cauldron. This and we need to make. Yeah, we probably should make a pit. Uh, copper, All right? One piece of copper. Safety. Okay, there's that. This and that. Uh, that should be it. All right, we got our alloy smelter. Cool. Oh, I ran out. Ran out of what? Uh, fences. Oh, oh, nice. Alright. Where are we putting this? So, we could do with just sort of moving the sarg mill. It will put the alloy smelter... Put the alloy uh, smelter where, there? ...where that was so that we can just cook all the stuff up. And then, no, if what you do, do is set that to input from the top and output to the right. Input from the top and output to the right. Okay. Yeah, I'll go and grab you another chest. Cool. And so that'll take all the stuff. And um, if you look at what this is doing, you can see it's got two lots uh, of, of gold in there. It, yeah. It'll actually cook up three lots of gold at once. Oh, sweet. Um, and what I'm going to set it to do is to be a furnace only. The music did stop. One second. I don't know why I did that. Let's just go back to here. There you go. So what did you do? Sorry? So what I did was I set the alloy furnace to be a furnace only. Oh, okay. Because you can have it uh, make alloys, as, as the name suggests. Right. Uh, which are things like um, Electrum and, and stuff like that. And we will use the alloy part of it, but I just didn't want it, you know, grabbing particular metals out the top and turning them into alloys. That's fair. 
we're gonna uh, do it automatically. That should, and fortunately, the Sarg Mill as well has kept its power, so this has got. Oh, nice. Sweet. Got a load of power in it. Alright. So, we've got about 50 minutes left. What should we do now? Okay, um, I think we can still automate this a bit more. Uh, the biggest problem we've got at the minute is that we don't have, like, a a chain, we don't want to keep having to swap the alloy furnace over for the chest and for the, the sarg mill. Right. So we want to do it so that we go into the sarg mill, straight into the alloy furnace, out into a chest. Right. But obviously to do that we need to, we can't just put everything next to the capacitor because it won't transfer the power, we need some power lines. Okay. So what kind of power lines are we need? Do we need? Uh, Ender IO has some good ones, and they are called uh, conduit, energy conduit. Enhanced Ender. I'm guessing just regular. Uh, it's just called energy conduit. So we need conductive iron. Yep. And binder composite. How was that? Oh. So that's a mix of clay, sand, sand and, and gravel. And clay. Okay. Uh, and then the conductive iron is an alloy of iron and redstone. Okay. Which we can make in the alloy furnace. Sweet. Well, I guess I will go find some. Um, clay. Let's go find some clay. I'm sure there's some clay right over here. I'll go and grab some of this gravel that is handily lying around. And just like that, we have clay. Brilliant. We'll use a lot of this binder composite. It sort of forms the basis for all of Ender... Ender IO's conduits, really. <laughs> also, are they regular slime? First thing is first, we'll make a lot of this stuff. So we need composite. So sand, gravel, okay. Clay, gravel, sand. Alright, a bunch of that. And then we need. Ah! <laughs> you son of a... Uh, and then I guess we just need to cook up... Is that what we need to do? Right, we need to smelt the composite. Yep, so that's where we go to the alloy furnace for. being very quiet. Uh, it is very quiet. Mm. I don't know what's going on. Alright, so... Put the composite in here, then? 
Uh, so yeah, you can put the composite in there, and that will cook into uh, the binder stuff. Huh? How do I do that? Oh, there it goes. There it goes. All right, cook away. Uh oh, wait, that's making tin. That's um, wrong. So what it does, uh, when it grabs it, it grabs some of the things. So what it'll do in a minute is so it'll make three lots of binder composite. It takes it out. If you see, it's made the conduit binder. Wait, what? I'm confused. So, uh, pulverized iron's in here now, yeah? Yeah. But there's actually three less than when it started cooking, so it takes it out and starts cooking those three. So if I was to take that pulverized iron out now, we'll get three iron here, because it was already cooking that. Oh, okay. Do you get what I mean? Yep. There you go. Okay, so then should I just put the composite in this chest then? Um, yeah, do you want to make up the uh, iron with redstone and iron? Uh, yeah, I'll go get some redstone. And yeah, it, it holds the materials in a buffer and doesn't output till it finishes, that's what I was trying to, trying to explain. Okay. So I need to put iron and redstone in this thing right now? Yep. And what you'll want to do is change the function from furnace only mode to um, like a smelting mode, uh, an alloys mode. So it's the fourth button. Fourth so do, button I, do I take out what's in here right now or what? Uh, yeah, you might as well. If I take everything out of this chest above, that'll help as well. Yeah, it's kind of weird because... Hmm, okay. Uh, so we need three. Well, I guess we need more than three, right? Uh, six if we can do it. Okay. So Probably all we need for the minute. So alloys only? Uh, you can change it to alloys, you can change it to all smelting, it doesn't matter either way. Dear god, that's slow. It'll do three, a few at a time, I think. Uh, it looks like it only does one. <laughs> oh no, it will have grabbed one, yeah. Cooking alloys is a bit trickier than, than otherwise. Alright, well we got one, and we got lots of the binder, so that's good. I guess I can put this stuff back here. I guess I'll leave this up for now. Two, one more. <laughs> All right, so come on, come on. There we go. All right, so we have enough of that. So now I can come over here. Make a uh, trying to steal this crafting Yeah, uh, out of cobblestone again. Probably. Probably. This here. All right. I have got eight energy conduits. Okay. All right. Let's Grab what cobblestone I've made. Mm. 
So now what we want to do is put it so that the master um, exports to the bottom and then move it so that the sarg mill is under the chest next to the alloy smelter and then the chest where the sarg mill is. Sorry, say that again? So, we'll move the alloy smelter and grab the sarg mill. Oops. So that we go like that. Oh, okay. And like that. You put three of the conduit underneath the capacitor. So that it goes out the capacitor into the machines. Oh, so I need to cut out underneath here. So that's not actually where... Yeah, I don't want that one there. So I want it here. Like that. That looks right. Uh, yeah, that looks right. Uh, and then if we just change the configuration of... This so that that is disabled and that is output. So now, if you change, if you want to change how the sarg mill and the alloy smelter are set, so that it goes pull from the top, output to the right. So pull from top. Push from the right, and then this pulls and pushes. So I think that's set up right. Oops, uh, let's have a look. Pull from the left. Output from the right, yep, that looks right. Pull from the top, push to the right, cool. So if I put some cobblestone in there, we'll get sand, and the sand will get pushed into glass. Do, do, do. All right. So the other thing we could do is, have you still got some conduit? Yep. So you could put conduit between the generator and the capacitor bank. What's that? So, like that? Yep, that's perfect. Because then what we can do is we can get another two generators here. And then conduit. Oh, so like... Need those as well. Conduit, conduit, and generator, generator? Yep. Cool. Alright, well I guess I will go build two more generators. Um, here you go, I've got two furnaces here. Uh, Alright, generator. Furnace. Right. So I need two pistons.
Yeah, I was just gonna be like, I need cobblestone. I knew you would. I was trying to lock it doing it. Sweet. Do this. And do this. And this. This and this. Cool generator, and then oops. No, that's not right. Cobbles on top right now. Yeah. Enough cobble? Yeah, I need more. There we go. Perfect. That'll be good. Cool. Alright, I got two more. And I guess we'll probably need some coal. You got it? Uh, yeah, I've got uh, 25 coal. Sweet. Should do for now. Go here and here. Uh, we don't have cork walls that I'm aware of, but we can always build a muffler. For what? Uh, I think people are having issues with the uh, sound the cows are making. Oh. Uh, sound muffler. Yeah, we can. I can make that. We can make a sound muffler. Oh yeah, I've got my sound turned right down. <laughs> Oops, that is not... What is the recipe? Oh, wool. No oh, crap. Alright. Uh, we do not have... Wait, why is that... What? What was that there? Where did that go? Did you pick up a piece of conduit? Yes. Oh, weird. Um, we need a lot more wool to make this. How much wool do we need? How much wool have we got? Five. We need five more wool. Five more wool. Okay, we can do that. Sheep over here. I wouldn't say we have plenty of iron, but we have enough spare. Sheep! Sheep, sheep. Thanks. One wool. Oh, you made shears? Yeah. You are much kinder to the sheep than I. Ooh, berries. No, I just wanted more wool out of them. <laughs> there we go, I have six wool. Here is your wool, sir. Sweet. Well, nine wool. Jeez, you spoil me. There we go, the sound muffler. Now, I'm just gonna put it right. Excuse me, pardon me, cows. No, hey, get out of the way. You're in the way. Can't talk anymore now, can you, stupid cows? <laughs> Should probably finish this fence. Yeah, it sort of looks half assed. We should also maybe, like, bring the cows above ground. <laughs> now that we've got a fence. Yeah, uh, sub basement cows are actually kind of funny as well. Do we want to automate this cobble generator? 
Uh, yeah, we can do. We've got. We're gonna have to do it with the redstone, but we can do it with uh, the same way we did with extra utilities last time. It's really easy. Uh, if you want to make a transfer node, there's a chest there. Transfer node. Uh, which requires transfer pipe, which is stone slabs, glass, and that. I don't believe we've got an electric fence in this. Oops. There we go. There's the transfer pipes. Transfer node is... Ooh, do we have enough redstone? Yeah, we do. Okay. Yeah, we need, like, a block. I yeah, think. you need a block of it. Because we and certainly don't have any enderpearls. Block of it and these and the chest, two stone and the pipe. All right, we got ourselves a transfer node. Um, I guess should I make a barrel? Yep. Have some more wood. Barrels. Better. Uh, barrel. So we should have Java on this. Yeah, we do. Do we need anything else? Uh, the only other thing you'll need is a world interaction upgrade. Oh, right, yeah. So that's what used to be the mining upgrade. Uh, it's now called a world interaction upgrade. World interaction. Lapis. Iron. Okay. Four lapis. Fact, how many barrels can we make? Need some iron. Uh, Java barrel, 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 barrel. Electric fence mod? There's an electric fence mod? That sounds terrifying. There's a mod for everything in Minecraft <laughs> these days. <laughs> Alright, we got the world interaction. Uh, the other thing I want to do before we set this up is move it so it's not right here. This is a weird spot for it. Yeah, it's just because I was trying to plonk it down. Do we have... do you have a bucket? I do! I'll bring it over for you in a second. Um, where? Oh yeah, I have a bucket of lava. I uh, don't have a bucket of water though. It's uh, actually let's make it right here. Have a bucket. going. So you have on you uh, several barrels, don't you? Uh, I have one. Okay, you've got one barrel. That's good enough. All right, a second. There it is. I'll show you something that's uh, quite cool you can do in mod pack 
I go you. Ow! Oh, right, okay. Can I have that transfer node? Yep. Do you need food? <laughs> yeah, that would make sense. I could eat some of this monster jerky I've got on me. Sounds good. Uh, I have no food. I'll get food in a second. Don't worry. Right. So, what I've done here... Wait, what? Transfer node hooked up to a crafting bench. Okay. Hooked up to some barrels. Yeah. Put the world interaction upgrade into the transfer node. Uh, it needs to go as an... Oh, whoops, yeah. Button. I put it in the wrong one. Huh. What is it just... And look in the chest. Gravel bricks? What? Yep. So, you treat this as like a little crafting grid. Oh, what? And the world interaction... And the, the crafting bench and world interaction node... Uh, we'll basically use that, take all the items out, and craft it. Oh, that's sweet. So it's like, um, it's like auto crafting, but on a big scale. Huh. Alright. That's sweet. It's cool, but it's not what we're doing. <laughs> yeah. No, that's sweet. All right, so I set this up over here. Oh. So, uh, so like we did before. I think you have the uh, transfer. Night and night. All right, so that goes on top right here, right? Yep. And do I just put the barrel? The world interaction. Do I just put a barrel on top? Yeah, put a barrel on top. And you need to put the world interaction upgrade in. There we go. And that Voila. is how you make infinite cobble very, very easily. So now this will just fill up 64 stacks of cobble, and we will never be low on cobble again. Correct. We can make it quicker if we so desired. I'm just gonna just gonna cover the lava up though. That's fair. And yeah, we could put speed upgrades in there if we wanted to. But it's just like, eh, for now I'm okay with it being like this. I mean we're already ahead. Yeah. We already have two stacks, almost. In, on the other server, we wanted, like, 7,000. I mean, we'll get there points. again, I'm sure, but for now, this is pretty good. Uh, do you want to grab a stick of barrel somewhere that we can start sticking things like dirt into? Uh, yeah. Let's just put it on the wall here. There you go. There we go. Have some filth. In fact, I have. We'll just that'll be on the barrel wall. I don't think we really have anything else. I have like we have a whole lot of traditionally dirt, sand, gravel. Yep. Sweet. And cobblestone, but that's outside. Well, we don't have to look at it. I mean, I guess we could put a, um... Um... Could we pipe out of this barrel into the indoor, into an indoor one? I don't know why we would want to do... Sorry? Uh, or we could pipe... We could move the barrel inside and just pipe into the barrel from the back. Yeah, that's true. Oh, I guess I have 
transfer pipe. Uh, yep, so if we break through, say, there... Can we break this barrel, or is it all gonna come out? It'll all come out. I guess it's not very much right now, so that's fine. And then go like this. Oops. And this. And that. There we go. Oh, wait, hold on. There we go. Sweet. There we go. There we go. Now it's inside with all the other things. Although clearly we need to move some stuff around to make it look nicer. Let's move these drying racks. Yeah, shift the drying racks around. Oh, I think you got one of them. Uh, yep. It's on the floor by me now. It's back in my inventory now. <laughs> back in your inventory. Uh, gimme, gimme, gimme. There you go. Yeah, I got it. Okay, sweet. There we go. Fill up. Yes, there we go. Yeah, mod pack is Direwolf 20. 1.7.10, you can find it on the Feed the Beast launcher. And I suggest you do so, because it's uh, it looks like a pretty fun mod pack. And we're only, like, we are honestly just getting started on this, guys. Like, there, we have barely done anything today. Um, ah! Yeah, we need to update the ah! display, nothing. Ah! Oh, God! Wither Cat! Well, that was a handy 200 death for Minecraft. Jesus. I don't want to go out there. <laughs> um. Well, there goes all that experience. Should have made the liquid XP. <laughs> uh, wrecked by a cat. Is that a normal it's witch or no? Ah, bamboo. What is that? That's not a regular witch, right? No, that's a with a witch. Oh man! Avenge me! Yes. Oh god, it's huge! Oh my god! It is. Oh god! Meow. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. Shut up, cat! Okay, hold on. Oh god. Oh, what's happened? Do we have bamboo? Oh, we yeah, have. There is bamboo in there. Ooh, I've got oh, a wooden. <laughs> oh god, it's huge. <laughs> Jesus! Ay, 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 ay. Where are you? Uh, my cross climb crashed. I died. I died again. I will be back in momentarily. Oh god! The witch is still around too! Oh. Maybe, maybe it's best to kill the witch? I'm trying. No! Damn it. Respawn. Oh dear. Hey, my client crashed. Are you still there? Yeah, I'm still here. Oh, okay. Minecraft also crashed for me. <laughs> I wonder if uh, the Wither Cat doesn't... Yeah, you've got that same blue blue um, window and then bang. <laughs> yep. I don't hope the cat is inside the house. That's our house. <laughs> I did not invite the kitty inside the house. <laughs> just scoop it up and uh, make a new house somewhere else. Yeah, exactly. Just time to move. Well, I don't reckon much to the neighbors. <laughs> uh 
Oh, come on. Hey, there we go. I'm still trying to load up Minecraft. Well, hopefully, um, they'll despawn. Alright, let's look what happened. Logging in. I hope. Internal server error. <laughs> Downloading terrain? Oh, crap. I'm still logging in here. Uh, the kitty and the witch are still here. Uh... Jesus. Ah! Oh, logging faster. Ow! This is terrifying. Let's just try again. What the? Is there two cats out here? Damn it! <laughs> Can we try and kill the witch first? If, yeah, I would love to. Oh my god, there's two of them! There there are now two witches. And two cats. <laughs> oh god. Fuck this. <laughs> and... Oh, and some slimes by the sound of it. Yep, and there's a giant slime over here. That I can. Oh, uh, just dead? Sorry, yeah, I just I went in creative mode and just killed them all. <laughs> ah, fair enough. Ah. Oops. Oh, that's your. That's your grave. I'm over here. Big cheats. Yep. Screw this. All right. Uh, what the heck, man? I did you end up. Know. I ended up with some stuff that I shouldn't have, so I'm just gonna ditch these down the hole. All right. Well, that was fun. And by fun, I mean not. Jeez. So maybe worth just putting a few torches down outside. Yeah. And what I was about to do before we were so rudely interrupted is this. If you go back to the cobble gen. Yeah. And look where the pipe goes into the wall. Ah, nice. Covered it up. If you want some XP berries, there's, uh, these are growing. Uh, I'm okay for the XP now. I'm not gonna use it for anything. Okay. Magnum torches require quite a bit. Uh, I can show you guys the Magnum torch. Or I could just not spell. Oh, it actually doesn't look like. Oh no, they're here. So this is. Um, yeah, you need quite a lot. 
You need a couple potions. You need five chandeliers, all of which require uh, a diamond. We don't. We only have five di or four diamonds right now. I don't really want to use it on a. I mean, a magnum torch. Ooh, torch placer. That's cool. Try torch. The torch placer is for Steve's carts. Oh, that's sweet. Um, um, it is sort of how I. Uh, I do actually want to do some more Steve's carts at some point. Yeah, for sure. Because uh, we did the tree farm with Steve's carts, um, but what is very cool is actually mining with it. So you have a, a little cart with a little drill on the front. Where? How do I? Waypoints. That's. Let's remove these. Uh, B. Yeah. There we go. And Control B to uh, remove waypoints. Ah, perfect. That's what I wanted to do. What's the QED? Uh, the QED. Uh, look it up in any eye. Yeah, I'm going to. I noticed that QED. Oh, whoa. Quantum entanglement device. Holy shit! Oh, we're definitely nowhere near a magnum torch if we need this. Um, go out of your inventory, back into your inventory, look at what the QED stands for now. Quad Errat Demonst- what? <laughs> Does it change every time? Yep, yeah, it, it changes randomly. Now it's a quantum energy device. Now it's a- no, it's still a quantum energy device. Quantum enrichment device. That's sweet. I love it. Uh, they're not too. They're not too bad to make. Uh, some of the more um, higher level extra utilities uh, items need you to make a QED and end of flux generators. That was weird. Oh, there's still a bunch of wood on this. Yeah, I got bored halfway through cutting down that tree. I hate these trees. Where there's just wood all over them. So much work. That's going to be night. Oh god. We're safe from the witches if we just never let it get dark. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that was the worst. Two of them was ridiculous. <laughs> All right. Yeah, it's the morning. All right, guys. Um, I feel like that's probably where we're about gonna leave it today. Uh, we can really quickly go over everything we've done. Um, we made a cow pit. So that's good. We made a sound muffler for the cow pit, cow pit so you don't hear them. Uh, there's a lovely sub wall. Um, remember, guys, if you subscribe uh, during my show, I'll make everything go away there, uh, including myself. Let's just do that. Let's let's make this real pretty. Boom! There you go. There's a sub wall. If you subscribe during my show, your name goes up on the sub wall, and the sub wall will um, move uh, with me from mod pack to mod pack so we just started up dire wolf 20 today um i expect us to be playing this for um quite a few months at this point for sure if not maybe even longer who knows um so remember if you sub during my show like those lovely people up there who sub today did your name goes up on the wall and will remain up there forever and for everybody who has subbed before today your names will go up um before next before my next show um, I just realized I won't actually be here for next week because I'll be in uh, San Antonio for PAX South. Uh, but the week after that, uh, I should be back, and uh, that will—that's when the next video games and video games will happen. Uh, we set up a very basic house today. A um, little bit of storage. We started off with a grindstone. Uh, we got some barrels of stuff going on. We have basically infinite cobble at this point. So lots of stuff there. Um, 
Dear Dr. James, Eldrazi Outlaw would say, how about you make a diamond pickaxe and go mine that meteor you found at the start as an end to the stream? Rebellious, does that sound like a good plan or no? Uh, that sounds like a thing we can do. All right. I will make the uh, the pick in just one second. Uh, we made our sort of machine room area. Uh, it doesn't have a roof right now, but that's okay. It doesn't need one. Um, we played around with uh, carpenter's blocks. You can see this cool um, corners and the little step, step up. Uh, we have power generation going on with survivalist generators pumping it into the basic capacitor bank, which is then feeding our sag mill and our alloy smelter, which, is, which are hooked up. So any of our ores going here, they get put through the sag mill into the alloy smelter out into here. So that's sweet. Uh, and I think that's about, that's basically what we did. We did die, we went mining, we died to a witch a lot, so that was fun. But now we're gonna make a diamond pickaxe. We're gonna use three of our diamonds. All right, diamond pickaxe is, oh God, made. Now, did you mark that meteor? Cause I, I did not. I did. Sweet. Let's go do it. Meteor did not land on me. It, um, it was already there. That being said- I'm gonna get some food first. Um, oh yeah, geez, that's a good idea. That being said, isn't there a way to, um, is there a mod in this that actually has like active shit falling from the sky. Uh some of the mistcraft worlds can have BTOs. Hmm. Uh we fortunately now have Ars Magic 2. Which does also have things falling from the sky. Oh boy. Alright. Let's go find that meteor. Or meteorite, I suppose. I did waypoint the house, didn't I? Yeah. I waypointed the house, so. That I remembered to waypoint. And the witch hut, apparently. I can see the witch hut. Oh, yeah, there it is. Oh yeah, it's right there. No, it wasn't far at all. Alright, so... Oh god, that was a big hole. So does it matter where I break into this thing? Uh, no, you're looking to try and get to the center of it. Should I go in through the top, or...? Uh, yeah, through the top's good. Need can I, can I get to the top? Hold on. Hold on, I can do this. There we go. Sweet. Alright. There's the center. Let's go! Oh god, this is slow. Wait, how'd you do that? It was gravel. Oh. <laughs> I was like, whoa, <laughs> what? Yeah, just fists of steel. Fists of steel. Yeah. Guy stone chest. Oh, I found it. Inscriber engineer press. Hey, that's one of the presses that we actually need for uh, some applied energistic stuff. Can I break this chest? You should be able to. I did. Is that so? That's it. Uh, that's very probably it. For what's in there? We will want some sky stone uh, later for some later stuff uh, for later uh, applied energistics. Sweet. That was underwhelming. Well, <laughs> I didn't say it was going to be cool. All right. Well then, let's go back home. <laughs> we will need to find a couple more of these. Because we need logic, engineering, silicon. I'm 
and calculation presses. Cool. All right, back home we go. This is indeed the 1.7.10 Direwolf, Direwolf 20 pack. It's not like it doesn't say in the lower third. <laughs> Alright. Alright guys. I feel like that was a pretty good start. And I'm glad we got the uh, the sub wall up and running. Ooh, from back here it's super glitched out. Oh yeah. Well Mom's is gone. There we go. Nice. Also, what the hell are this crap growing here? Stop that. No! Wow, that is so fast. Oh they're uh, potion plants. They give you random potion effects. Yeah, really? Oh, sweet. And they when they're sort of mature. Uh, the mini map. What's the mini map? What mini map uh, is this? Journey map. Journey map. It's pretty sweet. Definitely has a lot going. Especially when you get into the menu and press J. Yeah, there's a lot. Show caves. Man, this is a, yeah, there's a lot of stuff in here. Okay, guys. Um, oh, yeah, the cameras. I turned the camera off. That's right. Boop. I'm sorry. Uh, I guess let's go check um, Cookie Clicker. <laughs> because that is important to check. All right, let's disconnect from the Minecraft. Quit. Where's Cookie Clicker? There's Cookie Clicker. How many grandmas can I buy? I would like to buy... C all? Wait. Oh, sell. Why did I think that said C? Alright, we bought a lot more grandmas. Hooray! Why do I only buy grandmas? Uh, I don't know, because it's funny. Um, we were doing the same stupid thing when cl uh, Hero Clicker, or Clicker Heroes, where I only brought Treebeard, or yeah, whatever the heck his name is, so. Oh, what? GeoGuessr had a update on Monday with Canada mode? What? GeoGuessr. Canada mode? What? Canada mode? Where is it? Canada mode! Let's play! Oh god. I don't know where this is. Talbot, Belmont. This is somewhere in Ontario. Ooh, down here. Make guess. I was correct. It was somewhere in Ontario. Next round. Uh, senior Citizens Drop-In Center. Uh, Wet Taskowin Hospital and Care. Um, what's that sign say? That looks like it's okay. In <laughs> Brazil, let's say we're here. Nope, we're in between Edmonton and Calgary. Now, where are we? Trucks enter Appleton via River Road. Well, that's that feels like Alberta. Nope. Something called Appleton. Holy crap! Not even close. Moonbase GeoGuessr. Oh man, that'd be sweet. Oh god. Oh wait. I don't know that license plate. Uh. I don't know. Ontario again. Hooray! I was right. This looks flat. Saskatchewan. Yay! Oh, wait. Oh no, it was just on the... into stupid Forgetitoba. Alright. I think that's it.
I think we're done. <laughs> we're not playing that again. I need to go get food. <laughs> and uh, actually go, yeah. So thank you guys for uh, watching the show today. Um, I hope you enjoyed the Minecraft fun times. Uh, thank you again to Rebellious Uno for being here and uh, playing all the fun Minecrafts with us. Uh, if you're new and you liked what you watched today, wait, how are there two deaths in GeoGuessr? How does that even work? Um, you, it crashed. Oh, I guess that makes sense. There was, we, we, if you remember, we broke the map. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, so yeah, if you guys are new and you like the stream, give us a follow. Uh, that would be fantastic. And we will be back in less than one hour for uh, the new time zone, time slotted uh, Lure MTG. We'll be starting at 3 p.m. this afternoon. It is 2 p.m. as of right now. So we will be back in one hour's time for that. And yeah, as Pump19 in the chat just uh, uh, stated, although I guess Pump is a, wait, Pump19, what is that? Uh, Pump19 is Twisted Pair's bot. Ah, I was going to say. I assume that's a bot. But as you can see right there, Patreon. Um, go check out our Patreon. That is uh, that is our sole, uh, not our sole, but our uh, our main source of income this year. And you guys have been unbelievably generous so far. And we really appreciate it. So thank you so much. Uh, yeah, one hour back for LearMTG. Thank you, Rebellious Uno. I'll talk to you all very, very soon. Bye, guys. Cool. That's fine. <laughs> yeah, oh, that's fine. That works. I may well steal this slot to stream next week then. Uh, I did that last time. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I know you can still hear me. <laughs> Deal with it. Alright, thanks for having me again. It was good fun. Bye bye.